Welcome back to episode 6 of the quarry. Alright, yo, I'm in a bit of a bad mood right now. Let me just talk for a bit. First of all, so this is looking to be the finale. I know we got three more chapters. I don't know how long the chapters are. It seems they're similar to normal, so the goal is to just bang it out, get this game done. Uh, probably won't be updated till later, like late, late tonight. Obviously, you don't know when this is recorded, so it doesn't really matter, but... Uh, the goal is, after that, record a little episode of Persona 3 Reload. I'll try and stream it, see if that works, but I'll have the recording on, 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 on standby, just in case it doesn't. But holy shit, bro. I don't know, the Venn diagram of people who watch this and people who watch the LCS, it's empty because no one watches this shit, but, but like, holy fuck, man. Oh my god, C9 is so bad. Oh my god, man. I can't believe my eyes when I open... I open my stream to see them losing 0-4 already, and I'm just like, oh, maybe a bad team fight? What happened? No. Berserker Vulcan got got double killed twice in a row. 2v2! No jungler interference! Oh my fucking god, bro. They're so bad. Whippo, bro. Whippo's dicking on fucking... I'm gonna throw up. That's how angry I am. Fudge it, bro. Put the Aatrox down, bro, please. I've seen enough of Fudge Aatrox to know that this shit is ass. Up. Play some tanks, play fucking Cassante, play fucking Jax. Bro, put the Aatrox down. Oh my fucking god. I don't know if it's draft read. I think they have a horrible meta read for starters because Brand is piss broken and they gave, gave it to them for free. Cassante is way better than Aatrox, they gave it to them. It's like. A meta read has to be something. Or. I don't even. I can't even say if it's like understanding the comp because it's like. They're, it's not the team fight. It's not how the team operates. They're losing in isolation. They're getting on so far of a fucking back leg before the, the game starts, bro. Oh my god. JoJo is just the only performing player, man. I can't. I've had enough. This shit is horrible, man. This shit is horrible. <laughs> bro, like, oh my fucking god. Oh my god. I wish I could go back in time, meet JoJo, and be like, bro, sign with FlyQuest, please. But like, bro, can you imagine? This is like if LeBron left the fucking the bum ass Cavs that are carrying them for this whole entire career, went to the Heat, and then D Wade and Bosch start playing like fucking like Killian Hayes and DeAndre Ayton, bro. Like, there's no reason why these guys should be this ass. Oh my God, can JoJo get a trade? Like, bro, I'm so sick of this shit. They better lock in before playoffs, if they even make playoffs. I think statistically they have to make playoffs because it's top six out of eight, and they're three, three. But like, holy shit, bro. Just please tell me that they're good at best of threes, or best of fives. And even thinking long term, Swiss stage, they're gonna get railed, man. Like, this shit is so, oh my fucking God, bro. Like, what is wrong with them? They've all played together. How is this so bad? The only person who hasn't played with them is Jojo, and he's the one who's, only, he's the only one who's fucking performing. Oh my God, bro. That shit actually, you know, like, I'm in, such a bad fucking mood, bruh. Oh my god. What did my friend just text me? What the fuck is Air Buds? Oh my fucking god, bro. I'm actually sick to my stomach. The quarry, please give me a better mood, because that shit really... I'm sorry for ranting, but holy shit, JoJo needs, needs to be saved. I can't believe this shit, bro. LS, save this... Save this company, please! I'm begging to LS, save them! Tell them how to itemize, tell them how to draft, please, LS! But LS is fine fucking FlyQuest, and guess what? FlyQuest is playing well. It's actually gonna be energy first, FlyQuest second. Fuck it, bro, at this point, Ding and Toss are 100 Thieves might be third. Like, what the fuck, dude? Oh my god, they tricked us by beating NRG. I, I, can't, I can't believe what I'm watching. It's gotta be meta read, bro. These guys just don't know how to draft for shit. Alright, Ryan. Sorry, I'm- Yo, I'm pissed. Oh my fucking god. Alright, let's lock in. Back to the quarry. One thing I wanted to check is how much evidence do I have? I currently have 4 to 10. Okay. How much do you need? Like 5? If it's 7, I'm cooked. But, let's just extra- make sure we're looking around a lot. Alright. Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. Don't tell me to shut up, right? Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. She was a fucking wolf, dumbass. I didn't know who it was. Commanding, I said shut up. Caitlin, what do I do? Ryan, relax. Uh, Caitlin, what do I do? Oh, wow, real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. <laughs> oh, no way. I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. 
Just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. The body in the lake, too. Remember what Jacob said? What'd Jacob say? Yeah, right. Listen to me. These people are not who you think they are, I promise. Curious. You said you heard a woman. Hold up. You, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? Haga Haga Quarry, bro. What do you know? Haga Haga Quarry. It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? Haga Haga Quarry. This isn't <laughs> a ghost story. It's a creature feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. Your bracelet. What's up with that? Is it silver? What are you doing? Yeah, I'm not gonna be like. What on, are you doing? I'm trying to help. <laughs> no. Why are the only two options for Ryan right now? Is either be a bitch or be a dick. Like, bro, couldn't you just. Hey, uh, what are you doing over there? What are you doing, Caitlin? <laughs> like. What is Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And it's this silver. will kill them? For good? Yeah. See, Abigail's ready. She's. Yo, I. What if it's Nick or something? I'm still so fucking pissed at. <laughs> Yo. Bitch ass C9. That shit really soured my fucking mood. God. I'm sorry. I'm really. I'm tight. Oh my fucking god. That shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Their ass! Yo, I'm pissed, bro. I need some water. I need to cool down. Yo, what the... Oh my fucking god, bro. Okay, let's get back into it. No more thinking about C9. No more thinking about that dog shit. Bro, but it's like... Jojo Pino is so good, bro. But it's like... Ah! He could have been on FlyQuest, too. And I really like FlyQuest. I think Inspired is phenomenal. I think Buipo is fantastic. He's definitely... A, I think he's the best top laner in... Well, I, I'm, it's between him and Dokla. I feel like Dokla's safer and just skilled. He, you know he can... He can he can, he can be weak side against the big dogs. But with Buipo, he's... He, I feel like he is just has a way better meta read. He's more willing to itemize differently. You know, he's playing Darius. He's playing fucking... All the random shit, man. Inspired, obviously, is great. Master Busio, I was hyped on them, and they fucking shit on... Okay, okay, okay. Jensen's... I like Jensen. He's one of my favorite players. But, bro, he's old. He's past his prime. He's just a safe guy. He just wants his resources. Bro, if JoJo was on that team, they'd be so fucking good. Instead, JoJo's on C9, and C9 wants to play like bombs! They have the talent, though, so maybe they'll pull it back. We're like, holy fuck, I'm pissed. Okay. Like I said, worst case scenario. Path updated. All right. Ryan, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. Caitlin, yo. What's up with you? Yo! So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. I mean, he ran away. We don't know where that boy is. What makes you think I know? What makes you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? We don't know shit about him, bro, to be honest. He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Dude! They're just a house what? there? <laughs> There's just been a house there the whole time? Right. Compassion, maybe there's another way, man. Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about Nick, dude. Right, Ryan? Lock in. Okay, any clothes are going to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I guess you, Caitlin. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. 
Yeah, Chris has nothing to do with this, bro. We can find a way. I'm gonna show you that Chris Hackett has nothing to do with this. He wanted us to stay inside tonight. He wanted us safe. I don't care what you think. Damn. I don't care what you think. Damn. Shut up. Fine. Do whatever <laughs> you want. That little bit of bicker, bro. <laughs> Shut That's up. What happened to Nick? He was bitten. You just want to kill Chris, which I agree with. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole. Where is it? Car. Gotta watch out for the truck. Gotta watch out for the truck. Why? It was a stolen cop car. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get okay, so we gotta don't open the door because that's just just gonna pop off. How is it Dylan and Caitlin? It was Caitlin, or it was Dylan. Or two, I don't know. In the scene. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Is Caitlin there? Ten. Hold on, let me see that tarot again. Let me see that tarot again. The chariot. That's Caitlin. That's Caitlin. Okay, so Caitlin and Dylan. Better get going. Or with the car, is these to go to the house? I assume. I guess. Where the fuck does Abigail go? She's on our ones. That sounds stupid. Maybe Abigail's with us. Well, I don't know which us. Okay, I'm Laura. Abigail's just chilling in the pool house. Um, or she's probably with. Are you sure this is the right way? Caitlin, Dylan. Pretty sure. Yeah. Pretty or definitely. What do I look like? A tour guide? Right? Like, I'm trying to help. You been there? Have you actually been there before? I mean, n no. Wait, seriously? I know as much as you do. Right, bro. We're just some. We're just some kids, bro. It's not my fault. I don't know shit. How well do you know Chris Hackett? He's like my daddy. That's right. Pretty well. He's like my daddy. Like you're pretty sure we're going the right way. When I first came to camp, I was going through some personal shit and. Mr. H helped me sort it out. He's a good guy. You don't know him like I do. You don't know him at all. Okay, okay, jeez. Teacher's pet. That's my daddy, that's not my teacher. Why are you like this? Okay. To be fair, you know, she's been locked in a cell for two fucking months. <laughs> like, Look, if there's I... anyone who should be acting a bit like a dickhead, it's fucking Laura, bro. She's kept in a jail cell, or I got cut out by her boyfriend. Like, bro, she's been through some shit. I don't think anybody knows anybody, not really. Well, well I know Mr. H, and, and he never hurt any of us. Well, he well, bit my I boyfriend. Well, I know for a fact he's not the good guy you think he is. All he does is try to help people. That's what his whole camp is all about, to help the kids. Yeah, I don't doubt it. Here's my thought process. Here's my thought process, okay? So clearly they knew... Chris isn't a bad guy, I don't think. Because, like, the reason he got to Max in the first place is because he knew he's a wolf. He locked himself in the storm shelter, whatever the shit's called. Travis was supposed to keep him out. I think Travis is a bad dude because, bro, he is the most inhumane. Like, I know he's trying to do it for the better, but, like, yo, there's a better way than locking these two guys up for two fucking months. And Chris comes in, he's like, yo, what the fuck? But Chris didn't really try and free us or anything, so I don't know. Path updated. Pieces of silver. Abby came to Nick's aid. Abby shot Nick. Abby offered Laura her bracelet to fashion a silver bullet. To do, right? I know. But only if we can't talk to him. Good. Good. Yeah, I like that. I like that. I like that uh, idea. The thought process. Lead the way. The full moon. So. So is Laura in the process of turning, technically? Is she like Nick? There or? it is. Hackett House. Hackett House. So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? What is this, Resident Evil 7? It's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there. But if we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? That's a really good question. Oh, there's gotta be an entrance. Maybe we just don't. I get it, your friend, but bro. Look, I understand Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Sure. Yeah. We're gonna make a way then. Laura, 
Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. Hey, where are you going? You're on the timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. Okay, I like- oh. Hands on wires! Hands on wires! Hands on wires! Water, oh thank god. Oh thank god. Holy shit! Oh thank god. Are you okay? Laura? Damn it, Chris. Oh! It's like tingly. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Or, or she was just thinking. Oh my god, Laura. What's happening? Jesus, Mary and Jazz hands. The fuck? What happened? Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax, look. Oh my god. What big eyes you have, Grandma? Yeah, she's infected. No shit. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Yeah. Define yellow? Bro, it looks like piss. We haven't got much time. So she's turning, turning. We gotta get a move on. Alright, let's go, Laura. There's gotta be something back there. Yup, what's that? Yup, what's that? Yup, 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 yup. A box. What's that? Nope. Clues covered. This must be part of the old Miner's lunchbox. Makes sense. Septimus Hackett. I don't know Septimus. Septimus is a crazy ass name. It's like Snape's brother. What are that name? That's no, like a transformer. Septimus Prime. Like he's like seven swords or some shit. Mmm. That's gonna fire. Okay. What's this? An easel? No. Some hammers. Some. A pickaxe. Some hammers. These must have been Old from quarry the quarry tools. days. No duh. Damn, no one's Ryan. been down here for years. All right, well, up we go. There's a lot of clanks. They're so stressful. Holy fuck. Holy fucking fuck. That body of you. <laughs> That dog shit has black eyed peas on. <laughs> oh, she pissed that came to mind. Did you hear that too? Right. Yo. Oh my fucking god. Silas reminds me of League of Legends, reminds me of Bum ass C9, man. Fuck, I hate C9. Who? The hag. The hag gets quarry. Silas gotta be a kid, right? And she's gotta she's be the mother who off. died in the fire? Or guiding us. Shit. You think anyone heard that? No, they can't have done. Because if they did, we gonna be in some trouble. This place is not up to code. I mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. What's this? Keep moving. Yeah. Yeah, let's thug it out, man. Keep pushing. What the fuck? Did she just push him for fun? Jeez. Oh, or she grab his arm. What the fuck was that? Laura, you play too much. You play too much. You play too much. What's here? What's here? What's here? What's here? Okay, nothing. The lovers. The lovers, the lovers. There's a lot of couples here. Uh, yeah, there are actually. The lovers, there's harmony and disagreement brought to light only by sparks of passion. Blood flows from the heart, you can almost taste it. Tasting can save someone's life. Ooh, this is kind of erotic. Damn, we missed a lot of cards. Just look at this place. QTE's coming, I can smell that shit. Smell that shit from a mile away. 
QT's coming. Rusty ass stairs, come on. Now. Got him. Got you, girl. Don't worry. I could really do with a hamburger right about now. Ooh, a hamburger would go crazy right now. Lori, you play too much though, for real. That will. Oh, I'm gonna get a text from my from my from my from my friend. From my from my friend from my friend. All right, damn, you just auto walking, Lori. What the fuck? Waddle, waddle, waddle. Up. Uh. Oh boy, this is high. Whoa. Ooh, interaction. Ew, what the fuck is that? Do you think actually something is in here with us? Either that or this route isn't as disused as we thought. That's nasty. What the fuck is that? It was evidence though. That's really nice. Scarred flesh. Is this from a werewolf or a burn? I don't know. All right. All right, my phone's off. I'm fully locked in now. I was like 80% locked in, now I'm 100% locked in. Maybe 99, but... The thought of C9 doesn't even piss me off right now. I'm, I'm locked in. A long way down. So what's your deal then? What do you mean? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader. Bro, he just has social anxiety, let's so be honest. I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? Right? Like Inquisitive, what box would that be? Patient, no, that's not what I meant. What box would that be then? And what box would that be? Nothing. Forget it. Damn, do you always patient. do that? Do what? Uh, start to engage in a conversation and then just immediately recoil into your shell. Maybe I don't want to talk to you anymore. Oh, wow, charming. I am assuming you're single? Yeah, why? No reason. Why is she cooking him so bad? Lay off him, damn. This way, I see a light. You're just yeah. trying not to banter when there's werewolves and shit amongst or us. Or you can just hang out here, up to you. Loud Someone's been playing. eating their spinach. Boy. So, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? <laughs> you got it. <laughs> He's one first. Ooh, Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Wonder. The Wheel of Wow. Tara, Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel. Oh. The Wheel of Fortune. After all, Fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Come work some mysterious ways. Favors those who pay, who, the, favors those who pay attention. Watch closely through the wheel spins. The eagle eye can tell where it's going to stop. Out of these two, the lovers, I feel like. I feel like lovers so far, is that's the one I want to go with. If it says anything about saving a life, you know I got to get promising. it. promising. The fuck is the big ass cobweb? Yuck. Cobwebs are so nasty, man. It is so nasty. Hard hats. Nothing to interact with. Some ambiance. Oop. This is how you progress. Ryan's standing there. Nothing here, nothing here, nothing here. Is this a clue, maybe? Or an Careful. Item? Splinters. Thanks. I'm fine. What's inside? We found the party. Alcohol. From Prohibition. These are rum running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost 100 years old. Probably still good. Good. 
Try vintage. This music is stressing me out. Better to stay oh, on the shark. Hackets were bootleggers. That makes sense. I guess when the cores are down, they branched out. Hmm. Come on, time travel later. Interesting. So they used to, they used to be alka runners. I think this is it. Liquor uh, runners. Beats me. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. Hag, hag, it's Cory. Hag, hag, it's Cory. Hag, hag, it's Cory. That guy can score it. I can, I can score it. Alright, who's next? Whose shoes are we jumping into? Caitlyn. Alright, I gotta watch. We're, we, we gotta steer clear of the door. Steer clear of the door. Oh, because Abigail's with us. Alright, that makes sense. It's a cool little group. Cool little group. Guy broke in, tried to beat her ass. Oh, we can get the gun if it's still here. Yeah, my bad. Uh, that's kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the other guy. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing. Hopefully. Mm. I mean, should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing. The most responsible thing is to try and get help. Yep. Right. And then we can come back for them. We don't know where they are. And Nick. And Nick. Yeah, we're gonna cure everyone. Shout out my boy Max. I wanna, I wanna cure him. He's my goat. It's a creepy ass camera angle. Okay, car, car, car. Careful, careful. Wait. Don't open the car door. What? Just ignore that shit. Is there? Oh, there's a wolf in there. Is there something in there? It's a wolf. I don't know. I heard some growling. Bro, don't open that shit. Don't open that shit. Just what is it? Leave. I... Jacob. Don't... Emma. Bitch, that is a creature. Dylan, don't open Should it. I open it up. No, no, no. Funeral, buddy. Right? Why? It's gotta be QT then. Wazd. Hands on Wazd. Hands on Wazd. Oh, it's Emma. Oh, she makes me. She makes me. Oh. Hey, hey, it's us. Oh, it's oh, Emma. Shit. Holy shit. It hurts. Oh my god. Oh. I. Wait. I'm Wait. so sorry, Dylan. I am oh. so so sorry. Oh, I didn't know with you. I was really oh. scared, and I thought it's not Mace. What? Air freshener. Dylan, you you goofball. Bro said, oh, "I'm going blind." <laughs> you are. A, it's all I could find in the. You room. are funny as fuck, bro. Wait, what? Wait, what? I need to see graffiti shirts, but perhaps some, some kids are not. Huh. That was a bit of a bait then. Alright. Fuck it, we got Emma now. Ugh. Where's Jacob's bone ass? I'm really missing uh, hand. Dylan, <laughs> you're uh. Yeah, we noticed. We noticed. <laughs> she like put the thing across her neck as if like, oh, don't. He'll know. Don't say it. So he, she was in the police like, station no, this whole time. Insane, right? Yeah, her and Max. This whole time, we were having such a fun summer. We never knew. I don't know the shit you guys could do. Let's be honest. Respectfully. Okay. Can you fix it? No. I'm missing the rotor arm. Oh. Not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. So you can fix it? Well, no promises, but there's if only help. Jacob's dumbass didn't lose the rotor arm. Oh my fucking god. Also, what dumbass would leave the rotor arm in his undies instead of his pants if he's going swimming? Like, what the? Jacob, you really are a bum. I hope you know. Jacob might be my least favorite, low key. He's just too much of a colossal. I mean, Nick is just so boring, though. It's still Nick, bro. I really Sounds don't like, like Nick. Man, fuck Nick. It's like Nick's the worst, then Jacob. 
I need you. Dylan, come on. Look, I need you. We need you. Is Jacob's the worst? Fine. Or Nick's the worst than Jacob? Okay. But that's the bottom Once two. Once again, Dylan puts himself in then mortal like, danger for the sake know. of his work friends. Maybe Abigail. That was kind of cool. Abigail's not that bad, though. What exactly are we supposed to do? I mean, the van is nice, but it's not exactly Fort Knox. Well, there's a shelter under the lodge. You could be safe there for a while. The ladder, though. Right. The ladder. Abby, you're with me. You gotta be careful Goodbye. for the ladder. Don't take the ladder. That shit's broken. Yeah. Good lord. Hurry up, Winter. Good lord. Lord have mercy. Path chosen. All right. Path chosen. Path chosen. Paths. 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 Team building. Whatever doesn't kill me like stronger. A friend in need is a friend that bleeds. Teamwork makes the dream work. But this dream soon turns into turn, 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 turn. shit. Soon turns into a living nightmare. Dylan and Caitlin went to the scrap here to find a working vehicle. Okay. The chariot though. The chariot. No, I think the chariot terror was specifically for this interaction. It's the same car, same scene, right? I think so. I mean, I doubt we get a chapter. So, I don't think, you know, <laughs> I don't think, you know, are we in the house or, oh no, we're in the basement though, okay. we're still in the, in the, in the trail, underground, fell through the fucking floor. Is this connected to the red room? What was that? Uh-huh. Huh? So she's hacking. What was that? Travis freak oh, ass. Oh, nothing. We got, we got guests down. How's it got Travis out? We don't want any more blood on our hands. Travis, you are such a freak, bruh. Hackett House basement. Keep it down. You keep it down. Shh. Team these guys, man. The red room. The red room. All right, we gotta look around first. The Empress. The Empress. Look at her. Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame. To nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you. No listen she deserves. Huh. This has got to be for the... For whoever that lady hack it is. She's about to get bodied by wolves. That's what I'm getting from that. There's a lot to explore here. The red room is the natural progression, so we'll just avoid that for a bit. Check out all the other crannies and nooks. The Emperor. Oh, shit. How many tarot cards are there? Got Lee. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, structure designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall, and their empires with them. Let them bleed, let them rip each other apart, let them rot. I think that lovers is still the most important. Maybe Wheel of Fortune? Are we in here? I think this is where we got the Empress. Did we get some options for the tarot cards? I got some options. Let's go down here. Oh, I guess not. The blood. Oh. Careful. Okay. Oh shit. Red room. Jacob's in there. It's Jesus. From bed. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jacob. Jacob. Who is that, though? That's a real question. Hey, it's Ryan. Jesus. What happened to you? Open cage? No, 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 no. It's electrified. It's electrified. It's electrified. Don't touch that shit. Hey. Bad idea. Right? It's electrified. We knew that. We knew that shit. Let's go. We're paying attention. Oh, Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Ma. Uh, 
It's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. Yeah. The boys are bringing her in right now. Yeah, Ma. She's dead. Now I know you got a screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. Yeah, Ma. No. Yes, Ma. Damn. No, no, not my granddaughter, not my only granddaughter, she's, not my, she's kid, a not my little okay. Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little you Kaylee. goddamn piece of shit! Send me the old not guy with the hunter. Kaylee. Oh my god. God damn you! He didn't do shit, what the fuck? What did you do to her? He didn't do shit? Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Stop, Laura. What's up with Laura? I don't know what she's doing. Wait! It's him! Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Right? Hey, friend? hey, listen. Okay. They said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're they're not going anywhere. Remember? You gotta be sure. You gotta be sure. You promise. She would have blown his head off. Fight. Holy shit. Fight. You gotta get me out of here. Okay, seriously, man. Good thing I stopped it. <laughs> shit. They took it. They took it. You fucking idiot. Ma. God damn it. You fucking piece of shit. Get away. Get away from me. What the fuck? They're close. Yeah, maybe it wouldn't have been a great idea to just... Hmm. Interesting, interesting. They don't plan on killing Jacob or anything. Maybe it's better if we leave Jacob? Huh. Because if we help Jacob, we could fuck it up. Jacob's safe in this scenario. He's not gonna die here, right? But on the other side, hmm. I don't know, man. Because I'm thinking leaving Jacob here is safe. It's actually safe. But let's let's help him. Leaving Jacob, uh, I don't know, cause I don't know. I don't fucking know, man. Okay, okay. Let's okay. just get him out of here. Talk me through it. Okay, so all I know is you have to open my door and that door. And definitely not that door. Oh, cool. Thanks, detective. Okay, fuck you, man. I'm trying to help. No, fuck you. I'm trying to. Shut help. up. Shut up. Okay, there's a console on the wall over there, like a box or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Okay. Hang tight. Okay. Path chosen. Okay, three, five, Come on. two, four, seven, five, three. Uh. Oh shit! Fuck! 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 He's three, right? He's three, and then it goes five. So the I think. What we would want to do is three, four. Unless we go two, three, so it's away from him. Um, <laughs> I don't want to fuck this up. Uh, he's three, right? He's in cage three. Um, fuck. Uh, I don't know. 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 Um. This is hard, bro. They're giving me time, so I'm gonna let this person see it just so I don't click anything by accident. Bro, this is fucking hard. What the fuck? Um.
Shit, dude, I, we want to open three and five, right? There's no five, though. Do we, um, uh, this is stressful, bro. Oh my god. Let's think about it, okay. They showed on door three and five, right? It showed three and five. Three is his door, five is the middle door to get him out. I know that. They showed three and five. There's no five, though. Do we have to do, like... There's no five. Um... Three and five. Okay, so the obvious thing here is adding, right? Addition, one, four, five. What if we need three and five? Do we do three and then one, four? Or do we do two, three? One, two? On one hand, we can do three and then one, four. On the other hand, we can do two, one, or two, three. For three and five. Which would make more sense? One, four, and three? Or two, well, two, one, two, three. It's one from each. That's something. I don't know if that's actually. And then. Mm, we could do two, one, one, four. That's three and five. Fuck. So we can do. I think. I think it's between you do one, two, and one, four for three and five, or two, one, two, three for three and five. Because they're both three and five. How do you know which one though? Is there a clue or something? I don't. I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. As, 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 as. Um, uh, it's one of those. It's gotta be one of those two. It's gotta be two one two three, or one two one four. Either way, the first one's one two. Does the order matter? Um, fuck. Shit. Okay, well the first one's one, two, so let's do that. One and two, that's three. That's gonna work either way. It's either gonna be one, two, one, four, or one, two, two, three. So let's do one, two. And then two. Okay. Hold on, not just the middle one, dude. Don't fuck this up. One of them, please be stuck. Continue, what the fuck? Abandon. Oh, I can do this, I can do this. Focus, dude, focus. We just gotta get five now. Okay, what the fuck? Are you supposed to guess? I don't get it. It's either one, four, or two, three. How are you supposed to know which one, though? Ah, what the fuck? How are you supposed to know? There's two very possible answers. What the fuck? Um... Fuck. Can we seriously not go four? Can you go both? 
Can you? I'm scared. I'm scared. Can you do both? One, four, two, three. Does it matter? I don't know. Oh, now I'm stressed out. I don't think it matters. Does it matter? Fuck. Do I just do one, four? Or do I do two, three? Does it matter? I don't think it matters. I'm gonna do one, four. Good, we're good. Okay, we're out. Oh, let's fucking go. You look awful. Thanks. Hell, where's everyone else? Did that give me a heart attack? Um, Jake. Could you open the first guy by just doing Emma three straight? Or? I don't know where she is. But you should go catch up with them. Be careful. We came into the mines. I don't. I don't know if there's a way back up. No. But okay. Here's my thought process. Knowing that we had, to, like, you can't get five with just one lever. So I thought we had to add to get five, which means we had to add to get three. Do you get me? That's why I didn't do three straight, because I was like, uh. And plus, that being said, if you do three straight. Well, no, you would have been fine either way, actually. Eh, I guess we could have just tried three straight, but fuck it, we lived. That's all, really all that matters. Love's labor's lost. Decided to free Jacob, successfully open Jacob's cage. Thank God I was looking at the cage numbers, bro. Holy shit. I'm just clutch. Three and five, baby. Uh. Not my, not God, not, not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. Bro, no one gives a fuck about little Kaylee. Respectfully. Mima. Respectfully, Mima. No one gives a fuck. What? So... You, you had those motherfucking counselors in your goddamn jail for two whole motherfucking months, right? And you are telling me now that instead of putting a bullet into each one of their little sorry shit-stained brains, you, you gave them your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it? Is that what you were telling me now, Travis? You were so nasty, bitch. Back up. No more blood on your hands. That's what you, you, you said it. Oh my God, we are way past that now. Oh, Ma, what, what if it had been me or, or, or Bobby? What then? She was your family. A good boy protects his family. You ain't no good boy. You ain't no good boy. I wish I could take it all back. I wish I could take it all back, but I can't. Well, I just don't... I, I don't understand why you, you... You couldn't have just taken care of the problem when you had the chance. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self. I may be old, but I ain't deaf. I'm a police officer! Oh, so now I'm blind, you motherfucker. Jeez, was this the bear? <laughs> no, I'm blind. Oh, you just flashing that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in a gypsy fire. Ma. Don't ma. Don't ma me. Would you sit down, please? Don't you tell me what to do. Please. And don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't. Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you piece of shit. Man, Travis, man, smack her shit. I don't fuck with mom, Mima. Yes. Mima pissed me off. Mima is pissing me off. She wanted Travis to body our shit. Yeah. Ryan, run! Ma, send Bobby down. Her beauty is a tiger. 
You careful, make sure that shit okay. doesn't bite. Bite! Her beauty is inside her. That's why I need to find the key tonight. When I say yes, you say no. This one's kind of hitting though, hold on. This is the best chapter ending song, hold on. Hey, hey, the sun goes down, hey, hey. Well, I got some digestive cookies, like those hobnobs, I'm gonna get one of those. Oh, I got a shit ton of tarot to choose from. Did you miss me? Not really, ma'am. Hopefully, you brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? Hmm. The Empress. Look at her. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters, only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> but it's no less than she deserves. Hmm. That's definitely talking about Ma Mima, but maybe the little monsters is one of the hackets and not the werewolves. Oh, no, no, no. The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement brought to light only by sparks of passion. Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone's life. The Wheel of Fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Bro, the wheel smacking. spins, mm -mm -mm. the eagle eyed can tell where it's going to stop. I think it's Wheel of Fortune and Lovers for me. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, stricter. That's definitely like hack it coded. You know? How the mighty may fall and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rock. Details. Yeah, see more for sure. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. I'm doing Wheel of Fortune, bro. Fuck it. I'm doing Wheel of Fortune. It just sounds cooler, to be honest. Alright, what am I showing? What are you showing me? What the fuck? Look, you still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. I didn't see. Chapter 9. Dylan. Alright, let's see that again. Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Wow! So there's a wolf? Jesus. Oh no, that's Bobby. Right? With the overalls? No fucking head? What the fuck? Is that a glitch or is that real? Okay. Okay, hold on. Laura wolf's out. You're given the option. You don't shoot. And she ends up bodying everybody. Kills Bobby. Is that? Then she kills Travis. Or Bobby kills Travis. She kills both of them. Hmm. That's interesting. So I think 
Do I want to let them die? Did she kill me also? Hold on. Whose head does she stab? That's Bobby. That's me, isn't it? Is that me? Hold on. That's me! If I don't shoot her, she kills me. That's karma. I let Bobby die and then she bodies me. Okay. Okay, so I gotta shoot Laura if she starts freaking out. If she starts wolfing out, I gotta shoot Laura. That's what I'm getting from that. I got some goldfish too. Been there the before? matriarch. The scrapyard? Me mom. Nah. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. Yeah, I wanted the goldfish. I love having snacks. Who doesn't love a good snack? Does she seal with like sticker now? What if we just blend? like walk to the main road? This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything I need? Shut up. So basically, it's another oh, hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest whatever. Yeah. Oh god, Hanson West. I'm opening my fucking goldfish. Let me open this pack of goldfish first. Sorry if you can hear this shit. I'm still pissed about C9. That shit is still hurting me to this day. To this minute. Oh, goldfish. I need a handful of goldfish real quick. Oh, oh. Okay, we're back. So Constance is Ma. That's her name. Constance? Keep moving. Old ass name. Damn, Skullfish is hitting though. Mm. So, I guess this is me now. Right? What? You're gonna look great with a hook. We can call you Hooky McHookface. I don't these two get together. They're the goats. No one will treat me the same. This is kind of unique. Yeah, I guess it's pretty unique. I could get different. I get like a Swiss Army and I find like Inspector <laughs> Gadget. Man, lean into it. One hell of a story, too. Some yeah, I guess werewolves. it's something to talk about on the radio station. We're all gonna be laughing about this in a few years. You, me, maybe even Ryan. I think we missed our shot. Ugh, I don't know what that means, but... Kinda got close at the fire pit back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? Oh, us three. Was always next year, right? Well, let's get through this. Wait, does Dylan want Ryan, or does he want Caitlyn, or does Caitlyn, Caitlyn wants Ryan? Do these two want each other? Really I don't even know anymore. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident. And heroic. With an eye patch. So pirates. She's single. Oh, she's taking though, buddy. She shivers his timbers. <laughs> there. All right. The junkyard. We're here. We're here, boy. We're here, boy. <laughs> really, oh shit! Max is just chilling this Relax. whole time. It's motion sensor. We're okay. I think. Oh look, steampunk's back in. Ew! Come on, this way. I'm scared. Two people isolated in a fucking in a fucking junkyard. We're about to get jumped. I know it. Abigail. Okay. Back with Abby. We gotta remember the ladder's broken, so don't do the ladder. But there's an option to go up the ladder or do something else, we cannot go up the ladder. So what do we do now? Well, I guess we just make ourselves at home. Live up some cocktails, see what's on the TV. No? Why are you so positive? Why are you always so positive? Oh, why do you keep asking me that? Uh, I asked you about your confidence, not your whatever is happening right now. Right? Ugh, I don't know. I guess I just don't like to see other people sad. Is she voguing? The fuck? Ooh, is that why you do videos? Is that why you do the internet video thingy? Mm. Internet video thingy? God, YouTube, bitch. Whatever it is, you call it. Well, they just can't you say know, the word YouTube. People think influencers do it just for the attention, and influencers, oh hell no, they do at first. But after a while, it's like 
What's the difference between 4,000 rando likes and 100,000 rando likes? Probably 100,000 rando likes uh, can get you money but to live. I make people laugh. <laughs> I act dumb and they laugh. Maybe that makes me dumb? Or mm. maybe I just like to make people laugh. You love to entertain. I feel you, Emma. Emma, you're rising up the rankings. There's nothing wrong with that. Just being on a YouTube recording, I fuck with you, Emma. And you're hot, so. <sighs> fuck this That doesn't really affect huh? anything, but you know. Yeah. Just had to mention it. Come on. I wanna hear you say it. Fuck this night. Fuck it all the way to morning. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> okay, we're good. I just need to keep that in the back of my head. If there's an option to like run or flee, we gotta make sure we don't take the fucking ladder. Cause that ladder. Who's that? Orange? Easy, mom. That's Laura. Put me down, you witch! Blow your fucking head off! Oh yeah, yeah. I like that. I like that. Everybody, just relax. Can't shoot what you can't see, darling. Which I can. S oh my god, that's freaky as fuck. Bro, can y'all relax? Jesus. Gotcha. What you did to my Kaylee. Get the fuck off. I'm gonna blow her fingers off. I don't care. Oh my god, I didn't blow her fingers off. I blew her neck out. Oh fuck. Everybody stop! She shot herself. They can't see. They can't see. I'm lying. She shot herself. What the fuck is going on up here? She shot herself. She shot herself. She shot herself. Oh, wake up. Bro, don't CPR. Up. Bitch, her neck just got shot. Wake up. Travis, you don't even fuck with her like that. Come on, bro. You know it. Uh oh. Uh, I knew I shouldn't have done that shit. Oh my fucking god. We're shot. Fuck. I knew I shouldn't have done that, QT. Fuck. Oh, fuck it. Constance is a bitch. She's gone. Little Bobby. Hey, what did Empress say? What did Empress say? What did Empress say? What did Empress say? No. No. What did Empress say? What did Empress say? What did Empress say? The little monsters. The little monsters. The little monsters. The monsters that you nurture. Uh, fuck you, Empress. I don't give a fuck. Contest was a bitch. No, no, no. She pulled the trigger. She did it. It's her fault. I can lie to them. They didn't see shit, bro. I'm lying. If, if I'm in this situation, I'm lying. She pulled the trigger. Oh. No more protecting anyone. Travis. No, 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 no. Chill, 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 chill. She pulled the trigger. It's not my fault. She pulled the trigger. Not my fault. Not my fault. Not my fault. Not my fault. Right? Damn. Just stab me and dip. Yo, I didn't mean to do that shit. I did mean to do that. I knew I shouldn't have done the struggle. I knew it was gonna end with her getting shot, but fuck. 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 Man, fuck. Constance was a bitch. I don't really care. Right, I'm fine with that. Good. Fuck you, Constance. Pull knife? Whew. You pull the knife or not? Mmm. Mmm. It depends. It depends. If it's pierced something, I think you want to keep it in, right? Because you can't disturb it anymore? What if you pull it out? Oh, fuck. Uh, I think I want to keep it. I think. I think we want to keep it, right? I think we want to keep it in. Because uh, I've heard that when you get stabbed, you keep it, keep that shit in you, right? Or else you, like, you'll bleed a lot. Or if it's piercing anything. It's like a balloon. If you pierce it with a needle, it's like as long as you keep the needle in, the balloon will chill. But the second you pull it out, if you don't treat it, the balloon's going to blow up. I'm going to keep it in. No, keep it in, keep it in, keep it in, keep it in. Pause, keep it in. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Keep it in, keep it in, keep it in, keep it in, keep it in. 
You look hard as shit, though, boy. Whoa. Death? That's a pretty important tarot card, I, uh, I'd say. There's gotta be shit in this room. We gotta look around. No doors, no doors. Tricky looking at shit right now. That shit's just in me. That is. Ew. Is that poo or is that organs? That is nasty as fuck, boy. Look around, look around, look around, look around. In here. I don't wanna get too close to the doors. I'm scared. We gotta look around. TV? Is that a PlayStation? What the fuck? What's that? Letter? Can I read it for once? Can I read this shit? Damn, it's a long ass cutscene. Genry? Evidence. Love that. Love that. Uh, what's it say? Kaylee's letter. Kaylee's letter. Kaylee Hackett's letter of confession addressed to her grandmother. Granny? I really can't read that shit, though? Damn. Okay, there's two doors. There's this door, and then there's this door. This one probably leads to a bathroom, I think. With a layout. It's really just a, a gamble with either, but... Ooh, I almost missed this. Yeah, I think this is probably a bathroom, if I had to guess. Let's check this. Oh, it's locked. Okay, that shit doesn't matter anyways. I really got a knife in me. That's crazy. Oh, what am I looking at? What am I looking at? What am I looking at? Ready to react? Ready to react? It's like a closet? Bathroom? Steam? Didn't get much from that. We got the evidence for this chapter, which is really nice. And we got a tarot card. What does it say? You always gotta read the tarot. Always gotta read the tarot. Also, ooh! This chapter's where all the- Okay, so... The Empress looked at her the top can fall the hardest to shame to nurse of the monster only living. Okay, well she got bodied, so that doesn't matter. The lovers. Harmony and disagreement, brought to light only by sparks of passion. Blood flows from the heart, you can almost taste it. Tasting it can save someone's life. The picture lady biting a dude. Harmony and disagreement brought to light only by sparks of passion. Blood flows from the heart, you can almost taste it. Yeah. Wheel of Fortune. We saw this one. We got a blick at Laura when she goes crazy or else she's going to kill all of us. Emperor. Authority, paternity. Structure designed to topple. Now how the mighty may fall. Empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. So it says, fuck the dude. It's for the next chapter. Death. Death takes many forms. It can mean change, transition, transformation. Often interpreted as a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it just means death. All right, bro. I'm trying to be funny. Uh, ha ha. All right, then. All right. Who's that? Central C? Ugh. I don't even listen to Central C. I just like the ad-lib. All right. Damn, where the fuck do I go? This is stressing me out, bro. Oh, fuck. It's Bobby. It's big ass Bobby. It's big ass Bobby. Block door or hide? Block door, he knows we're in here. So I think hide is probably the better, better call. Under bed in cabinet. Under bed. Kind of seems like an obvious hiding spot. What the fuck was that? Oh, it's the door opening. I heard some weird ass sloshing noise, bro. Police one safe. Police one safe. This cabinet, I feel like he definitely opened up the cabinet. The bed, it's like. Which one's more likely for him to check? It's the cabinet. Settle down. Settle down. Okay, okay. 
Hands on wised. Hand on my keep mouse. Look at big eyes, Bobby. Damn, Bobby, you can't hear that? I'm close. Stand by. Over. I mean, just immediately followed me. Maybe I should have taken the knife out. Fuck. The knife seems to be hurting a lot. Let's go, Waz. Let's go, Waz. Let's go, Waz. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Get all that shit. Good shit, boy. Good shit, boy. You can't hide from me in my own house, fucker. He's <laughs> so You're redneck. A fucker. Right? Yeah, talk to him, Ryan. You're a fucker. You're a fucker. I'm really stressed for the for the junkyard. Laura, you blew fucking bitch ass Constance's head off. Constance is a bitch though. Travis, come on, work with me, Travis. Crap, I know I can convince you. Hide or run. Let's run. I don't think a bathroom's a good place to hide. We're rising, we're rising, we're rising. Down. Yo, putting the wires right before putting it down is crazy. That is some evil shit you're doing. Super massive. That is evil. Damn, I'm just sprinting out through this bitch. Travis, I know you can work with me. I know we can work together, Travis. Travis, just save me. Talk to me, Travis. I didn't shoot you. I apologize. I was cordial. I worked with you. I determined. Come on, Travis. Constance is a bitch. She was mean to you anyway. Oh, here. Shit. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Don't play the piano. <laughs> Dude, I swear to God, I thought I was about to play the piano. Laura. Don't fucking play the piano. No, I'm not going to play the fucking piano. What are I like playing the piano while I'm on the run? What the fuck? That is such a funny way to try and catch someone off guard. Holy shit. Ew, is that a warthog? There are bears around here. That's a bear skull? That does not look like a bear. Big ass gaping hole for the nose. You guys are hunters. They were... Ooh, so maybe, 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 maybe there were hunters and they created the werewolf gene. Out of like, because they wanted to hunt. A pound of flesh. Oh shit, we're almost here. Final twist of the knife. A gift could be a curse or a blessing depending on how you look at it. And when you're losing blood, your vision blurring can guard tell the difference. Ryan chose not to remove the knife from a stab wound. Okay. I don't know if that's a good thing or not yet. He looks like he's in pain. He looks like he's in pain, which is bad. But no blood loss, so. I think I made the right decision, but only time will tell. Dude, this blue lighting. What the fuck? What's this? It's a family tree? Is Salas here? Hackett family tree. Alright, let's see. Old quarry tools. Miner's lunchbox. Counselor's ledger. Lauren Master can have a Travis and Chris. Okay. Hackett family tree. Hackett family has been around for quite some time. The roots running deep in the local area. Chris and Travis, the brothers. Pressure secured the fire secures. Travis uses powers of sheriff to help his family cover their tracks since the fire secures ago. Okay. Caleb, Kaylee. Oh, this is this Travis? I can't tell. Some more shits. Shaka. Paid. I'm on low graphics, bro. I can't read that shit. <laughs> that shit looks like chicken scratch. Alright, let's ski daddle. God, this place is creepy. Ooh, the sun. Here comes the sun. Do 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 do. What's the sun saying? The sun, the vitality of a new day. Still some time to wake up to the warmth of a night survive. Your choice, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness to see the sunrise once again. Damn, these are some bangers. These are the last hero cards, I think, we can get, right? How many slots are there? Three more. I mean, last chapter we had four. And this might have been from last chapter, so. 
Five is totally doable. I mean, yeah, there's no tarot cards in chapter 10. That wouldn't really make sense. Like, what future are we getting? The game's over. Lol. Listen, old man. Listen, old man. Listen, old man. We can talk about this. We can talk about this, old man. We ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. Oh my god. Jeez. You know something? I ain't got enough silver to kill you. Holy fuck. But I'm sure to hell can make you suffer. Jesus, man. He. Right in the nuts. Hey. You want that knife if you can? Backhand, bitch. Old fart. Get shit on, buddy. Get that knife, get that knife, get that knife, get that knife. We don't gotta kill him, but get that knife. Damn. Oh. Run, 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 get out of here. Get a move on, get a move on. We're not trying to kill anybody. Okay, what's your position? What's your position? That light, that light is getting to her. I clicked run, why isn't she running? Ooh, good shit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. If we didn't get Jacob, he would have been bodied, no? Love labor's lost? Like he's just Jacob would have been bodied if we didn't save him. Holy shit, that's clutch. Where are you? God, he's old. Hey! Everybody fucking stop right now! Right? Let's go, Travis, get some order in here, bitch. Some shooter? Take her face off. No, 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 Travis. You know what she did to Kaylee? And she killed your mother, too. Mother was a bitch, let's be honest. Dude, you tortured me for two months, dog. Come on. Wait! Alright, wait. I'm waiting. <laughs> Travis, Travis, I fuck with Travis low-key. He's evil. He's not evil. Well, he is evil. He kept us hostage for two fucking months. Bitch ass Bobby from King of the Hills trying to kill us. That knife in my guts. Pause. All up in there. Pause. Bobby. Does he get shot? When bro starts blasting? Damn, he's on my tail. All right. Smooth sailing, smooth sailing, smooth sailing. Smooth sailing, smooth sailing, smooth sailing. Come on. Hiding in the... Jesus, that dude is huge. Holy fuck. Ain't no way you can fit in here. All right, let's go. Hold breath. Easy. Light work. Light work. Light work. We're good. We're good. Light work. Light work. This is so hard to fuck up, but like, it's so stressful still. It's way easier than, dude, but not moving your controller, that's just evil. That shit is genuinely evil. Like, I couldn't. I'd have to put the controller down immediately, or else I'm fucked. My hands, like, just be shaking. Ron, get out of there. Uh oh. Oh, come on, man. You gotta help me. I do? Please, Bobby. Yeah, I promise. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. With who? Stab? Stab? How do I stab? 
Lord did not attack Jedediah. <laughs> Yo, kind of. <laughs> I mean, you would be named fucking Jedediah. <laughs> Do we want to stab? I don't know what that means. Do I take it out of me and throw it at Bobby? I don't know what that fucking means. Oh. Uh... I don't think we want to take the knife out. I think we... Don't stab. Don't stab. Please. Oh, you he's right stole there. My knife. Okay, well, fuck. Well, fuck. Who the fuck is that? What's oh, Laura? Oh no, you've been bit. Pick on someone your own size. Oh, she's about to Travis! squeak out. <laughs> Yo, this dude's ran away. Travis! What the fuck happened to you? There, I got stabbed, oh, huh? Yeah. Nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, Ryan. Oh, how bad is it? Am I finna die? I'm so sorry. Am I finna die? Bad, huh? I'm finna die. I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max, how you? Not your fault. Okay. Not your fault. It's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. Are we about to die from blood? But I kept the knife in. How am I gonna block from Dudlaw? Dudlaw. Uh, you're not the boss of me. Right? <laughs> Talk that shit. Am I just? Is, am I actually gonna die, bro? What did I fuck up? What did I fuck up? Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. I would have died earlier, maybe, if I took the knife out. Though, right? mm, you're cooked, buddy. Long story short, you're cooked. Wait. Maybe it, maybe it will. What? Ryan. Ooh. If you let me bite you. What? If you Ooh. let me bite you, it means you'll be infected. Which means you'll heal which up. Means it will heal. Yeah. That means we gotta we gotta get to the root of the problem. But it also means Yeah. Yeah, I got it, big bad wolf. I mean, if I'm cooked without getting Ryan, bit, I don't have much time. I can feel it, like. If if I'm, I'm gonna die either way, or well, I either die now from fucking blood loss, or I get the wolf stimulus, and I can try to do shit and get rid of Hackett or the higher up, try to cure it before I die. So I, I feel like getting bit is the only option here, right? Probably. What are the taros? Lovers show it's getting bit. I mean, disagreement brought to light only by strength of passion, blood flows to the heart. You can almost taste it. Tasting it can save someone's life. Okay, yeah, so I think they're saying get bit. But, yo, did Max just get cucked? What the fuck? Lovers? That's kind of crazy. It even, it even looks. Well, it's just, it's just like a dark skinned dude and light skinned girl. They're telling us, bro. Let him get. And he's getting bit by the. Yeah, let him get bit. That's the play. It's fighting to get out. Yeah! If you let me bite you bit, and you bit, kill, bit, then. Then I have to kill Chris. So sick by Flyleaf. It's, it's not killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life. I, I don't want you to be and that guy, life. but you're a werewolf and too. And your friends too. That's it's, it's killing you, not killing a werewolf then? If we're using that logic? I'm getting bit though, that's the play. I'll let you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much, yeah. I mean, I'm getting bit, bro, regardless. Whatever you say, I'm getting bit. Bite me. It's your call. Now. Bite me, 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 bite me,
These guys are not lovers. Free Max. Nice and tender for you. All right, bite me. Hurry up. Before you get hungry and trying to eat me. Yo, she wants to eat me. Look at she's eyeing me like a steak. But she just bite me. No, let her bite. 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 We have to do it. Don't pull away. Okay, okay, okay. Are right, you got your shoe? She's hungry. She has the taste for blood. Path updated. That's gotta be pound of love, right? Or pound of meat, whatever that shit's called. Pound of flesh. Pound of love. Ryan chose not to remember the knife from the stab wound. Ryan had to be careful not to exacerbate his injury as he fled from Bobby. Bobby oh, took his knife back, worsening Ryan's bleeding. Ryan chose to accept Laura's offer to bite him. So what was the point of the knife? I guess maybe I could have killed Bobby if I stabbed him here. And if I take him out earlier, then I would have been in this scenario to begin with. Without, mm, I don't know, but if I, had the, if I had the knife yanked out, like here, as opposed to here, I feel like I would have died before I got to run in with Laura. So I feel like keeping the knife in was the right decision. Maybe not. Maybe stabbing Bobby was a good decision, though. That's... But I'm fine with it. I'm fine with Bobby living as long as I don't fucking die. Damn, look hungry, girl. Get you a Big Mac or something. <laughs> you should start to feel better soon, I guess. All right, well, I can... What the fuck? We gotta go. What? We didn't even experience the... Well, Laura wolfs out, so she still needs to wolf out for that scene to happen. For the, what was it? Not Love, it was Chariot? No, Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> the Wheel of Wow! Shout out Webkins. Shout out Artifact. Should we just leave through the door? Why are we going back upstairs? I guess we're trying to find Chris. That's why we're here in the first place. We gotta find Chris and body him. So Laura tweaks out, I gotta blow her. I gotta, I gotta boom her. Dylan, all right. This is what I'm nervous for, the scrapyard, bro. I'm scared. We're gonna get jumped by someone. Oh, and these are my like, two favorites. These guys never throw anything out, huh? Especially Dylan. So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped apart. parts. Just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got Motor it. arm, Dylan. Damn, Dylan really could have been infected if he didn't chop off his arm. That's crazy to think about. Oh, there's definitely a tarot here. Come on now. Question is where? You ding 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 Workplace. Uh, I don't know. Let's explore first. Let me progress things. Oh, frame rate. Chill out now. Hmm. Get some tools here. Big old button. What the fuck that is? Open up the door. Okay, cool. I need to see some stairs, so I'll make sure we go up there. <sighs> Are we gonna end up in a documentary? No. Shut up, Clint. Let's go. Wait, don't move. I wanna go up the stairs. My frames are really dying though, what the fuck? Let's go up the stairs. I think I have a note here. Calendar. What's this? August. Full moon, 22nd. These sons of bitches had it all planned out. They've been new about the full moon. What 
What's this? Is that a bingo sheet? I thought. Scrap your nerd. SUV body damage. Keep this off the books and out of the thing. Uh, where is it? Scrap your nerd. Okay. Scrap request to keep something off the books is a little dodgy to say the least. There must be something here they don't want anyone to know about. SUV body damage. Who's T? Travis? Mm -hmm. It's Travis. SUV body damage. Maybe Looks it's like these Max's. Guys are the books a little. Maybe it's Max Laura's gotcha. car. You said it. Right. Because they pulled up to the uh, to the the, the the camp. And they got the shit stolen, or they got drugged and kidnapped. And the car's not here anymore, so it's probably Max and Laura's vehicle. That's why they want to keep it off the books. So it's like, okay, we can. These guys are gone. We don't need to worry about that. There's actually a lot to explore in this little nook, this little cranny. Not enough, I guess. Alright, move out of the way. Let's go. Let's go, next area. What is this lead? The fuck? Did you see that shit? Lonnie just locked in for a second. This place is huge, low key. The fuck? We found the clue for this chapter, so we don't need to worry too much about that. But maybe there's something we can pick up. Oh, also, we need to find the fucking runner arm. Or whatever it's called. Brian's okay. He knows what he's doing. Probably he just got infected. He here. just got infected, <laughs> by the way. You took me back to the pen. Okay, we got all our shit here. How big is this place if it's making it lag this much? No other place has lagged on my computer like this. Just seeing all the lighting and shit. No tarot cards though, we've only got two so far. Yeah, these wet ass footsteps is gross! This shit is squelching. Like what? Listen to that shit, it sounds like you're stepping on slugs. Yuck. Yuck. Okay, a lot of stairs here, lots to explore. That lit up first, let's go up here. Okay, and it's gonna progress and I fucked oh. up. That maxing things? Oh, I'm getting out of there, fuck. Whatever. Oh, it's a cutscene. Alright, fine, fine. So, you ever operated a crane before? You know, I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. That is a horrible ass nickname no, to have. No, uh -uh. Oh, I hear that. Now. The grabber? That well, is nasty, bro. Why you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? Then you were grown and kids were calling you that? Oh, hell no. Watch my back. Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um, just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. Maybe I should take the gun. Fuck. Maybe I should take the gun. Maybe I should take the gun. Maybe just c it'll come down to Caitlyn being a badass. She's a badass though, so. If I put my money on her being a badass or not, I'm taking the over. That makes no sense, but you, you get what I'm trying to say. Right. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean up after themselves. I only got one arm, bro. It's gonna be hard as okay. shit. Let's hand. see what we're working with. All right, not too complicated. Welcome back, grabber. Now you fought in a way. Oh, what shit. the hell is going on? My bad. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. The wolves are gonna come, bro. All right. Here goes nothing. The wolves are gonna come. Honestly, in a situation like this, I think it's better to have Caitlyn have the gun. 
Because I'm operating the crane, plus I have one hand. Like, that's gonna be tough. She might get wicked. Damn, I'm nice with it though. Hold on. Is that is that Max and Laura's? I don't know. She did it. Watch my back. But it's not over yet. I'm scared. I'm... Yeah, uh, I think I found my calling. About time. <laughs> I'm scared. Well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing. Dylan, running. turn that shit off and get here. Come on. Go. Score. Dylan, turn that shit off and come over here right now. I'm not playing, Dylan. Dylan, I'm not playing. Turn that shit off and come here. Movement, 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 movement. It's a, yo. More Caitlyn, more Caitlyn, more Caitlyn. She has a gun, she has a blade. I should have pulled the car up, shouldn't I? This shit is hard as fuck right now. She has the gun, though. She has the gun. You have the gun! Come on, Caitlyn, you have the gun. Hurry the fuck up! Slam car sound horn. Oh my fucking god, 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 oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god, 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 oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god, oh my fucking god. Okay, there's two ways to think about this. One, slamming the car. I know this is cheating, but I don't give a fuck, bro. I'm trying to... You're on chapter nine, no one's fucking dead. I'm scared. I don't want it to go out like this. Okay, on one hand, if you slam the car, more of a chance the zombie dies, the wolf dies, but there's a chance that Caitlyn dies. You honk the horn, no harm to Caitlyn directly, but it's less possible that the wolf gets fucking knocked out, right? Oh! I'm leaning horn because I don't want Caitlyn to get hurt. I don't want Caitlyn... I don't want Caitlyn to get hurt. But at the same time... Um... Shit. I'm actually really scared. Fuck. Fuck. I don't want Caitlyn to get hurt, but at the same time, the wolf, if I honk and the wolf is fine, she has the gun though. So I feel like honk is the smarter play. Um. My fucking god, dude! I'm sorry. Pause. I know that's scammy, but holy fuck, I'm scared. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna honk the horn. I'm gonna honk the horn. Is that wait? If I'm honking my horn, won't that just make the wolf come to me though and eat my ass? Let's slam. Let's slam. Let's slam. Let's slam. <sighs> Let's slam, let's slam, let's slam. No! Okay, tired. She's good, she's good, she's good, she's good, she's good, she's good. We gotta waz though, we gotta be ready to waz. She has the gun, her gun's gone. Her gun's fucking gone. No. Dylan, Dylan, uh, drop the wing car. Drop the car on the wolf. QTE, QTEs, 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 come on. Come on, come on, come on. This music is hitting right now. I'm in the zone. Let's go. Body that bitch, Dylan. Body that bitch, Dylan. Body that bitch, Dylan. Let's go, Dylan. Let's go, Dylan. Let's go, Dylan. Let's go, Dylan. Body that bitch. Body that bitch. Body that bitch. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. Dylan, I'm wet for you, bro. I'm wet for you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ugh. Uh. Realistically, I feel like both decisions could have worked, but it would have been QTE dependent, but I feel like I not having the gun and honking the horn, not having the gun and honking the horn. I shouldn't have paused during that. I know that's scammy. I, I, I won't do that again. But yo, I'm stressed. These are my two favorites. 
not honking the horn. You can't honk the car's horn from here and blast it off. You're honking my horn to distract it. But I gave the gun to Caitlyn. So I feel like that would have been bad. It would have just ran up to me and I got one fist. It would be hard to fucking defend myself. At the end of the day, we're both alive. I don't give a fuck. I scammed a little bit. I don't give a fuck, though. Worth. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. For realsies. Yeah, you know, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me in the movie about how brave I am. Don't push it. At least you're my favorites. All of these two. <sighs> so, his voice acting was going crazy there, too. So much for Love that. Our brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? Did you find the thing? Better than being out in the open. Come on. Let's root the car first, though, no? We have the car, might as well check it out. Path updated, path updated, path updated. Path updated, path updated. Is that wolf dead, by the way? Who, which wolf is that? Team building. Kaelin and Dylan work together to escape the scrap yard. <laughs> Yo, that probably kills so much tension by me pausing, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just thinking about it from since like the music was kicking and then it paused for a good like 10 20 seconds. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro, but I'm I'm too anxious when it comes to this shit, bro. <laughs> I'd be I'd make sure. Alright, we gotta avoid the ladder at all costs. We can't just sit here. Why not? Dylan said it's safe here. Well, yeah, I just I don't wanna be waiting around. But that's literally all we need to do. Just wait until morning, right? Fine. But we need protection. Go see what you can find. It's better than just sitting around. All right, we gotta look around. That shit was awesome, though. That scene was... Oh, what the fuck is that? That's a hag. Is the hack who's showing us the tarot cards, by the way? Oh, that shit was awesome. The music was hitting. Good lord. The ladder. We can't take this. The rung's loosened. We shouldn't take it. Fuse box? Surveillance room. Huh. Looks like the main fuse is gone. That's why there's no power? Why would somebody do that? Silver or just it? regular shotgun? Silver shells. Silver. How'd they get down here? The hunter must have dropped them. This is probably how he got upstairs and attacked Caitlin. So we got, guys we got silver there. shells now though, that's good. Very good, very pog. It's good, we got those silver shells. Is it, is it path updated? Did I see? Team building. Yeah, we got Emma found silver shells in the storm shelter. That's just a reflection. I thought this was interaction. Yo, my heart is my heart is on a hundred right now. Ooh, Hi Hi Hierophant. Love that, love that, love that. What's that? What's it saying? My poor boy. Do you see what they did to us? How they hurt? That shit is hard as fuck. That wolf. Ooh, he's out there still all alone. Each full moon they hunt him, armed with silver, trying to put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show with Blaze six years ago. Stupid children, but little Silas, my little white wolf, you must be protected. You must not follow this path. You understand? Remember how I helped you all this time? Oh shit. Okay. Silas is the hag's daughter, who is the white wolf. If we can kill the white wolf, everyone's cured. You must not follow this path means we're going against the hag. Which I think we should do. Remember I've helped you all this time? So the hag is the one doing the tarot cards. Wow. Wow. I mean, we got to do the, the, the hero, 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 uh, the hierophant, hierophant, elephant. Is his name Hierophant? What was Kakuin's stand called? It's Hierophant Green, right? Or Green Hierophant? How do you pronounce that word, man? 
I'm playing Persona tonight or tomorrow too, so fucking tarot cards. What'd you find? <laughs> uh, just Jesus check Christ. out this ladder. Is that a tiny little door up there? Hierophant Green. Uh yeah. We'll open it up. The the ladder's Why? loose. The ladder's loose. We don't know it's up there. Exactly. It's Have you not been paying attention, like at all? Okay, what I mean is the ladder's broken, y'all. The ladder's be broken. Good for us to have an escape route. You know, we don't know what's up there. It, it, the lodge. There, there also could be a, a way for no, us no, to No, no, no. The ladder's shots. broken. Don't play with this. Ladder. Don't play with the lodge. Shit. Okay. Guess that makes sense. The ladder is broken. Abigail, get ready for QTE. Ladder's broken. Or one of the rungs is broken. I'm ready to QTE. <laughs> They're totally gonna make it a QTE, and if Abigail falls, she dies. I'm so certain on this right now. They foreshadowed this shit in chapter like one or two, man. You all right? Oh, well, yeah. Okay, yeah. that was that was close. Hmm. Hmm. The only one the trapdoor in Christophe's didn't loosen the wrong ladder. The ladder rung broke when Abby climbed up. So this is either gonna be an extra QTE or. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe it would have been like if me and Emma were to escape. One of us loosens it, the second one breaks it, and that would have fucked them over. But now we know it's broken. This is a we're good now because we know it's broken. Yeah. Dennis should just bonk around the head. You see that shit? <laughs> I love how they animated that. That's exactly that's exactly how it would have been. In the real that is hilarious. The shelter is like it just the door just banging on you as you try and get up through it. That's fucking hilarious. All right, so they found out that it connects to things room, Chris. Laura, Hackett Family House. I mean, she's going for Wolf mode now, isn't she? Oh, well, they ain't getting through there in a hurry. Man, this place. Okay, so here. Okay, here's my idea of the of like the, the behind the scenes story. Also, hold on. Team building. On the way to lodge. Okay, here's my idea. My thinking process is. So they have the harem scarum, right? Future fire. Room to be arson. So we know who did it. Hmm. Two hikers. They caught on fire, killing the hag and Silas, which was her unborn son. And then she was a ghost. And she turn Silas into a wolf or that's their curse as Silas being the white wolf something along those lines the question is still who I missed a lot of Haggai Street clues though scrapyard note Max's car yeah okay it's got a lot of clues we need to see My the real question is who did it though? who just started the fire I think it's implied the hag did it soon. and that's why the hag cool. wants to kill all of them but I'm feeling pretty Good. The sheriff did die though, and the sheriff's not a hacker. What are you doing? Kid. Stop it. Do you smell that? No. He's terrified. No. Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out, maybe. I'm done being chased and stabbed. Sure. And another way out. Fine. Okay, okay, okay. More needles? Huh. The anesthesia? What's that? Pray we're on the right track. Stay close. Yeah, all the better to see you with, my dear. Shh. Hmm. No, oh, Lord have mercy. Watch your step. Yup. <laughs> yup. Red, I see red. Oh my god. Is this Chris? What was that? Is Chris shackled here? That's Chris. It's gotta be Chris. 
Yeah, they locked him up here so he couldn't hurt anybody. I think we found Chris Hackett. Yeah, do we do we blow up Chris Hackett? Son of a bitch. I don't wanna kill Chris Hackett. Oh my fucking god. Don't go serious. Shit, don't go serious. Chris, we're all in the house now. Oh, she's about to wolf out. She's about to wolf out. She's about to wolf out. Oh, it's over. Uh oh. She's about to tweak out. Damn. Silverback mirror. Silverback mirror. Bobby! The gun! Dude, the one on Bobby is crazy. Look at those pants. Bobby slump? Bobby slumped? Is he dead or is he just slumped? I don't know. Yo, this is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. Choose my ass. Lord's life. How the fuck did that happen then? Oh, we killed Chris. Chris is dead. Chris is dead? Oh, we killed Chris, so Laura got saved. Thanks. For, um, not killing me. Yeah. Likewise. So, what now? Everyone's back to normal? Damn! Was there a way to keep Chris alive? If we okay, if we didn't shoot Chris there. No 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 Taro 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 Wheel of Fortune. There's two wills in this. This is why it's fucked up. Laura freaks out. If we don't shoot Chris here. If we don't shoot Chris here, Chris kills us, Laura kills Travis and Bobby. Or Chris kills Bobby. So we have to shoot there. We shoot Chris. Chris dies. Laura's healed. She's saved. Does that mean... That means Max is good now. Nick is good now, too, right? Unless Chris isn't the one who bit Nick. Mm, but here's the thing. I don't think Chris is the one who shot and bit Nick. Because assuming... Well, obviously, when nighttime came, Chris got up out of there. I think he went right back to the Hackett house and they chained him up. So I don't think the one prowling at night was Chris. And if it wasn't Chris, it was probably, it could have been Kaylee. But no, they bodied Kaylee and Nick was still infected. It could be Caleb, maybe. We don't know anything about Caleb. It could be, I don't think it was a white wolf. We would have probably noticed it was fucking white. Unless it just looks normal. Uh, Who else is there? I don't think it was Max or Laura. Damn, was there any way to save Chris? Laura did not shoot Travis and scheme herself. Ryan shot Chris Hackett with silver, curing his line of infection. Damn, was there no way to save Chris? I'm trying to think what could have happened to where we wouldn't have fucked up Chris there. In that scenario, we have to shoot Chris. 10 times out of 10, we can shoot Chris or we die. How do we avoid that scenario from happening? We went into the attic. Damn. I don't think Chris can live. Yeah, I don't think I don't think there's a way to save Chris because at the end of the day, we're coming to the Hackett house. I don't think there's any way to prevent us from going to the the, the ceiling, the attic, or whatever the fuck that it was. So I think 
It was the right choice at the end of the day, but I'm just trying to think if there's a way to not kill Chris. I think Chris had to die. It is what it is. What? Oh. <laughs> you think this is over? We still gotta kill the White Wolf, Silas. This isn't over. I think Travis is on our side now. The White Wolf. I don't understand Chris's death. He's not the original werewolf, man. Oh. oh, Chris wasn't the first. That's not possible. What do you mean that's not possible? Caleb. Kaylee. The girl you killed? Her brother. Is Caleb the first? Is he the White Wolf? So he's what? probably the one who bit Nick, then. <sighs> Caleb bit Chris and Kaylee. Chris was just trying to protect him. He was a good man, my brother. And he was a good man. Well, then who bit Caleb? Silas. Silas. Yup. There it is. The White Wolf. I've been tracking him for years. He's a gypsy, a transient. I think Chris has to die. I'm, I'm, ha I'm happy we chose the choice, the but I'm... Hope come back so we could end this. Anyway, there's sightings up and down the coast. A uh, feral albino child. He is giant, giant white, though. White wolf. So Caleb is the one who killed... Caleb's definitely the one who bit Nick. Because Kaylee bit Nick, but Nick's still out here, I think, right? If we do the order of operations, I think... Yeah, I think... I think he runs off after. So it can't have been Kaylee who bit him. So it's definitely Caleb. But we want to get the white wolf. That cures Caleb and Nick. That's their strain. What? It's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like Silas bit Caleb, who bit Kaylee and Chris. Kaylee didn't bite anyone that we know of. Chris bit Max. Chris bit Dylan? No, 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 no. Chris bit Max. Max bit Laura, who bit Ryan. So Ryan's the only person. Oh, shit. Wait. If the wolf who bit Nick or Dylan was, if the wolf who bit Dylan was Kaylee, Kaylee got bodied immediately after. Wouldn't Dylan have been cured? So didn't we just cut off his hand for no reason? Fuck. Uh, shit. If it's not Kaylee who bit him, then it's still the right call because he would have wolfed out. That would have fucked up everything post. But like, oh, fuck. Dylan could have kept his hand. Shit. If that was Kaylee. We got another. Okay, paths. Pound of flesh. Not from the knife. Stab wound. Ryan had to be careful. Ryan had to injury. Take the knife back. Ryan was bleeding. Ryan was, uh, Ryan was safe from blood loss. Alright, cool. So Ryan lived because our choices. What whale? Not shoot Travis. Shot Chris Hackett. Much farther ordeal at the Hackett house. Okay, cool. What'd you say? Where? Where'd you see it? Hey, buddy, at, the, at the cabins earlier tonight. Okay. 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 Okay, it makes sense. Well, scratch that. Okay, Silas is the one who was there at the, at the radio hut. Silas ran off. She blicked Kaylee, who was just there, I guess. Or she killed Kaylee earlier and threw him in the water. I don't know. Doesn't really matter. But that would have been Silas who would have bit Nick. So never mind. Cutting off at the right deal... Because I just saw like Dylan. Because Dylan would have wolfed out way earlier. Not been part of the crew. Might have died. We don't know. It's all right. I'm, I'm okay it all with makes that. sense. Uh, he must have been back for months. And he's what, he's what ran you off the road two months ago. Mm. Right. Help me. Right, 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 right. Right. Because it couldn't have been Chris who ran them off the road. Because Chris was locked in the storm shelter. Duh. So then, theoretically, if Silas is alive, can we have... Or Caleb, can we have one of them infect Dylan and then Blick Silas? That would be possible. That'd be kind of bog. Help me. We can still save Caleb. We Yo. can still save what's left of my family. Laura is fucked up. We, we can help those who are still alive. I'm down, Travis. Let's go. Took two months of of you fucking holding me hostage, but I'm down. Why the hell should I trust you? You didn't shoot me when Jebediah was there. I'm not asking you to trust me. I'm telling you we can end you this. You didn't shoot me when Jebediah was there. We kill Silas. You didn't kill me now. Everyone gets better. 
everyone uh, who's still alive anyway. Chris, RIP Chris. I respect Chris. He's trying to do his best to keep okay, everyone alive. Okay, so... Uh, Constance, you a bitch. I'm not mad at you dying. I know to be exactly honest. where to find him. Okay, let's go. Thank you. Laura is this fucked up. This doesn't mean I forgive you for what you did to me. He's not asking for forgiveness. He just wants to work together. Yo, can you get her some clothes where she's drenched? Can someone right? please get me some fucking clothes? Just take fucking... Yo, take Bobby's overalls. Is Bobby dead? What happened to Bobby? Did any of the paths update? Path updated. Alright. Find Silas the White Wolf. Above the law. Lie to the cop. Left Travis locked in the cell. Shark Constance dead. Lord did not attack Jedediah. Travis had to work. Lord to find Silas. Mmm, okay. We're with Travis. I kind of fuck with Travis. He's evil, but I fuck with him. It is what it is. That's gotta be chapter end, right? Surely. You had your chance. You had your chance. Yeah, you're the hag, bitch. That wretched family yeah, you you're not slick. Doesn't matter. There's still time. We can still come out on top. Past is the past. Let's just <clears throat> look to the future. Is she gonna get pissed we? if I don't, uh... Is she gonna get pissed if I choose her heart Death. Death takes many forms. It could mean change, transition, transformation, often interpreted as a, a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it means... Well, it just means death. <laughs> the sun. The vitality of a new day. Yep. There's still time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. You are such a freak, old lady. I know you're the hag, too. I'm choosing the Hierophant. That's right, bitch. I'm coming for your son. The Hierophant? Where did you find this? He's pissed. Where did you find it? This shouldn't be here. I'm bodying Silas, huh? He's been through enough pain. No, no. Silas no. is living a life of, of torture. My poor boy. You see what they did Oh, so we see us. it no matter what. Oh, shit. Cutscene. Now we get to see the burning. Hackett's quarry six years ago. Eliza. Who the fuck is Eliza? Oh, she's Eliza. The hag. No. Oh. <laughs> What have they done? What have they done? Damn, she had a black eye on the right. Oh! God, this. Oh my God, that's Silas. Hear him, scare him, Eliza. Ah, oh, so that's Silas, the dog boy. So Silas was like a weird little Silas, freak, my boy. and he's like a touted as the dog boy. God, you were nasty. I'm sorry, but damn. That shit's gonna blow up. Oh, that's just gonna impale you. He. She could fully just get her killed. You know the QD there. So then you probably don't hear the rest of the flashback. So Silas, even like as a human, was like wolfy a bit. Or is that the officer? That's not Silas. That's the officer. Or did the officer do it?
That's the officer who died. Mommy's coming, Silas. Mommy's coming, Silas! Silas! Silas got away, Silas! so he... Silas was always cursed with lycanthropy, I guess? So is the point of the sheriff being burned showing that the sheriff is a cause of it? And the sheriff was a hackett? Cause she, she is always talking about that wretched family. Or maybe the Hackett's caused the fire to kill the sheriff and take over his job. Those are all her tarot cards. And that was her shtick at the circus. She was like, she did card readings. Interesting, 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 interesting. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what they did to us? How they hurt us. He's out there still, all alone. Each full moon they hunt him. Bro, he's been alive for so fucking long. Let him die. Silver. Babes. Trying to put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid shit. Little son. Or maybe the Hackett's were kids. A little hmm. white wolf. He must be protected. He must not. Follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how I've helped you all this time. I'm sorry, babes, but remember how much I've done for you. You, he's gotta die, bro. You're doing him a disservice by keeping him alive for this long. Like, holy shit. Let him die. Let him die. Okay, Max. What chapter is this? What the fuck? Is this chapter 10? Laura Charles and Ryan decided to work together to find Silas. Okay. Oh, this is chapter 10. Max chapter. Okay. I'm gonna take a break here. This is all gonna be one video, so this is gonna be a little cut, but I just wanna make sure, you know, everything's good, so I'm gonna take a little break, let my laptop cool down, recharge, and then I'll be back immediately after, so... Jump cut. Wow! With, uh... <laughs> Back with chapter 10 of the quarry. All right. I took a little break. Get some food too. Oh, Go back. Go back with Max. Oh, hands on wires, hands on wires, hands on wires. Holy shit. What the fuck? That just scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Why am I top of a fucking tree? This is Max's first playable chapter, I think. I think, yeah. right? From my been two, two and two together. I think. We don't really need to look for anything. Actually, mm, maybe evidence. We should be able to look out for evidence. Tarot's don't matter. Clues can be nice. But only oh my god! Aston answer. <laughs> Fucking Max from my goat. My goat. <laughs> Where the hell am I? Okay, we're back here. The treehouse. Ow, my phone. I always say ow when I drop that shit, even though it didn't hurt me. Silly mage, little quack. Okay, so the clothes Emma stole were actually from, were actually Max's. You gotta be kidding me. So what's he holding now? What? <laughs> Whose clothes are those? Are they just were they just there or were they uh Laura's maybe? Maybe she packed a bag too? I mean I can't lie, he kinda has this shit on. I really can't lie. Okay, what's this? Still need that last piece of evidence for this chapter. Don't we should have just gone to the harbinger myself. Seven sounds good, but I don't know. Yeah, we definitely should have gone to the harbinger, but or at the end of the day, Jacob's bum ass was still getting us in the same fucking situation. This shit pisses me off, bro. Jacob, you are a fraud. I'm hyped, bro. I'm hyped to get this shit done. Let's go. So far, 10 chapters. No one I care about has died. The only one who's died is... Kaylee died. I don't even know if you can do anything about that. Constance died, but really, who gives a fuck about Constance's bitch ass? I think that's it. I don't think anyone else has died. 
Nick's just out there running around being a wolf and shit. Is that a ponytail slit? That shit looks so weird. I mean, it's, would you not just put your ponytail through like the, the adjuster slit? Why do you need an extra one? That looks so silly. Anything, anything, nothing, no interactables. No interactables. Nope, cutscene. So, let's run down like a progress report. Abigail and Emma are in the lodge currently, because they went out for the storm shelter. Um, Travis, Laura, Ryan are hunting Silas. Um, Abigail, sorry, I said Abigail. Jacob's who knows where, he's just running around. He's free, he's safe. And then Ryan, Caitlin, or Dylan, Caitlin are. They just did that shit at the grave, or the junkyard. Okay, so I can stay on the shore. I mean,. I know I said that earlier with uh, Jacob, that if we left Jacob, he'd be safe. And then we found out, oh, he actually would've been fucked if we left him. But I think in this scenario, stay seems really like, stay, there's nothing that can happen. Surrounded by water. I don't think anyone can get to him. I'm kind of just stuck here. I think if we do stay, he's alive for sure. Soon to shore, there's risks, he might die. Maybe him coming will be clutch and save someone though, but. I kind of, I'm, I'm greedy, bro. I kind of want Max to just live. I'm going to go stay. I think that's safe. I don't think anything's going to happen if he stays. The wolves can't get here. Literally nothing can happen to him. Yeah, I mean. So Max is like, he's good, bro. He's chilling. So what wolves are still out there? Silas is out there. Caleb's out there. Nick is out there. Nick, who, where the fuck even is Nick, bro? All right, let's go. Kaylin Dylan, my goats. Help me. Let's go, let's go. Hands on West. I see that my hands are not on West. <laughs> okay. Well. Can't get much worse than it already is, right? Oh, jeez Louise, man. Just like the cartoons. Just like the cartoons. Just like the cartoons. Just let the car. Just let the car. Don't like the water, remember? Right, right. Oh, we should have just been swimming in the lake all night. And die of hypothermia? No. No. All right. Well, we're good now. <laughs> Night's not over yet. These fuckers know we're in here, and they're coming back first chance they get. Great news. Okay. All right. We gotta get a vantage point. All right, well, let's, let's, let's do this. Let's do this. What's here? What is this? What are they cooking in here? Some, uh, some chili? Some stew? Yeah. Oh, what's this? There's a box. Oh, it's Abigail's bag. What the heck is this? That's a bitch ass toy from chapter one. God, Brenda Song looks good here. Holy fuck. <laughs> the bunny's just here now? Okay. Will that bunny finally play a role? What's this? Closet or some shit? That bitch ass bunny finally play a role in anything. A chapter one decision coming through chapter 10 is kind of fucking hilarious though. So I hope the bunny is useful. It's a distraction, that's not bad to have. What the fuck? Maybe there's a tarot card there earlier that I missed? Cause these angles, like that angle specifically is usually when there's a tarot card. Look at me spinning, bro. Is that shit? Wee! That's such a tarot card angle. All right, Dylan, move out of the way. Uh-huh. Door. Bear. Tables. Okay, it looks like we explored all we can on this floor. On to the next, I guess. 
This shit is so dark, though. Can't do anything here. Yeah, I mean, we don't want to leave the lodge. That doesn't seem very smart. Ooh, anything down here? Any clues? Any evidence, mayhaps? No. no. Alright, let's go upstairs, then. Hut, two, three, four. Hut, two, three. Damn. Get the stairs, babes. Can I really... Huh? I can't go up the stairs? What? Is that bugged? Maybe I'm not supposed to go... Oh, I assume that's a that's a bug or like an invisible wall. What the fuck is that spaghetti? Some bolognese? Ugh. Okay, I can go up these stairs. That's nice. Do 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 do. Me and my boy Dylan. Pick it. Is that Constance and Jedediah? The baby is blonde. Is that Bobby? It looks like Bobby. A little milk dud head. It's not even milk dud, it's like a big ass. Like a beanie baby. Not a beanie baby. You know something else. It's like something you find in the fucking kindergarten. In the Kinder Surprise eggs. That's the size. Like the capsule. Nice to put a name to a big mean face. What does that say? So what, you're like Mr. H's brother, I guess? I didn't see what that said, bro. I'm on low settings, I can't read that shit game. Who? Is that Bobby's? The big dude from earlier. Okay, when you and Bobby. Ryan went to the radio hut. Mr. H's brother, I guess. Right. So Bobby, Travis, and Chris are all brothers. And then Constance and Jebediah are above them, and then Caleb Kaylee are one of their kids. Probably not Bobby's. Maybe Chris? I don't know. It's Chris or Travis, I'd assume. It could be Bobby's, I guess. They go to camp, though, so maybe it is Chris. Does that really matter, though? Ooh, what's this? Crumpled up letter. Jeez. I'm see, really struggling if they're begging for a dollar. Huh. Chris Hackett is asking campers' parents for additional donations to help with lodge renovation costs. Is that what camp fees are for? Where else would that money be going? Bloody collar. Bloody collar looks to be too big for a dog, and a dog would be called Ian anyways. Blueprints for structural repairs in the lodge's chimney column. Judged by the scrawled annotations, it's not something that Chris Hackett has the money to, act, auction, to action right now. That the Chris Hackett is asking campers parents for donations means that these repairs might be more crucial than they first thought. Interesting. So they're broke and they want to make renovations. It's almost like they need to make renovations for whatever reason. Uh, Alright, we came out this way. This game is so dark, bro. There's probably settings to brighten it up, but... I mean, I'm in chapter 10. What do I look like changing the settings now? How long has this guy been here? Ancestral portrait. A uh, large and overbearing, the regal oil painting of Septimus Hackett holds pride of place on the largest chimney column. Okay, this is Septimus. This Long is like a fucking Transformers ass name. Did I say that already? Long enough ago that it was. I don't know if I did. Okay but have an oil I feel like I did because it feels like something I would say, but. I kind of want an oil painting of me. Like Septimus Prime. <laughs> That's such a Transformers ass name. I keep looking for. Keep looking. Maybe We're not we should ready keep yet. looking. Yeah, we gotta keep looking, babes. God, she looks. Brenda's song is so fine. Oh my god. Kill, I'm gonna get you through this shit. Don't worry about it. You too, Dylan. Ticket Damn, stub. Ticket stub. Ticket stub. Ticket stub. Where's the, the stub? Hidden behind a photo frame, this ticket stub is an indication that Chris Hack and his two kids attended the traveling show Harem Scare six years ago. Damn to Revelia. Flowers are promoting a traveling show called Hiram Scram. The date listed indicates that it took place over six years ago. Same as the post from the woods. Why does Chris Hackett have them? Was he connected to Hiram Scram in some way? Chris Hackett was there. He and his two kids were present on the night of the Hiram Scram fire. Ah. Huh. So they probably no, made... Absolutely not. They started the fire, we, we I'd assume. That's why the hag is so angry at them. Right? I'd assume so. Uh, This way. 
we go. Here, no. Here, no. Okay, let's check this room out before we go upstairs. It seems smart. Gotta scope out the place. Ooh. Poor Ian. Some camp mascot to kick it before camp starts. Well, nine sight. Sounds about right. Wait. We so Ian was the mascot? mascot? But no, we did. But you didn't hear? He hear what? He died before we got to camp. Uh, bummer. If Ian's collar... Okay, so what? Chris Werewolf just ate his bitch ass? Right? That makes sense. If his collar wasn't there. Clues. Camp scare poster. No, no. Ticket stub. Hit him behind a photo frame. The ticket stub is an indication. Chris Hackett's kids. It turns around. It's great. Chris and his nips scare him. Scare him. Killed him. Kaylee knows what would have happened. Perhaps he kept this ticket stub as a constant reminder that things could have been different. Family photo. Kaylee's dead, however happy they once were, that's all changed now. Kaylee infected both his father and his sister six years ago. Sometime after this photo was taken, now he's the only one left alive. Damn. I feel bad. Caleb and Kaylee Loki. <laughs> Kaylee got bodied. Forgotten belongs of a quarry miner abandoned the tunnels. Flutter foreclosure within but he hates that this has been down here since the nineteen thirties. Since Miss Hackett was running the show and the Hackett's fortune started to crumble, he's responsible for closing down the quarry all those years ago after failing on hard times. Falling on hard, on hard times. Suppose that the Hackett's hunting prowess who think they'd want to cover up the bullet wounds and signs of injury. Perhaps they serve as, as a reminder that these animals are definitely dead. Hackett's killed these animals with silver after they survived world fights and became, became infected. No telling what this infection would do to non-humans, but it seems the Hackett didn't want to find out. Safe to say. Memorial to the deceased camp mascot, Ian. From the looks of the drawing, Ian was a sheep, though nobody got to meet him this year. Campers never knew how Chris killed and ate the camp mascot. In fact, they didn't know a lot about camp leader Chris Hackett. A dog would even be called Ian anyway. Ian was a sheep, the camp mascot, something slaughtered him down at the storm shelter. Chris Hackett killed the camp mascot on the night Lauren Max were kidnapped and hiding in the storm shelter. He devoured Ian in an attempt to satiate his appetite. Didn't work. Okay. Camp letter. Chris Hackett is asking camp parents for additional donations to uh, help with lodge renovations costs. Isn't that what camp bees are for? Where else would that money be going? The camp is in worse shape than the fees can cover. Island, lakes. Lake Septimus, Radio Hut. Oh, wow. So we got everything. Paths. I'm missing the white whale. Lord did not shoot Travis from escaping her cell. Ryan shot Chris Hackett with silver, curing his Lyme infection. Ryan started the ordeal at Hackett House. Laura, Travis, and Ryan decided to work together to find Silas. Team building. Dylan Kaylin. Yep. Skip the scrapyard. Found silver shells in the storm shelter. On the way to the lodge. Company in the lodge. Okay, so we need to get the silver shells from, um, from those two, from Abigail and Emma. Do 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 Alright, I almost forgot about the stairs. Here we go up we go. Do 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 What's that? Where have I seen this emblem before? It's a ring. Inscribed jewelry. Discarded jewelry thrown off in a scuffle. Inscription reveals that it belonged to Bobby Hackett. What is it? A ring with a crest on it. Oh, very fancy. You can never pull it off. Sorry. Banter, love it. These two are probably my favorites. I'd say it's these two. And then after it would be probably Laura Ryan Max. Probably Laura and Max. I like Max a lot. I remember Mr. H's cheesy ass announcement. Max would be third Loki. Whoa. He's so irrelevant to the plot, but I love him nonetheless. He's just a goat, man. He's just a happy dude. Jacob, Jacob is bottom tier, bro. Never Honestly, Nick might be worse than Jacob. Camp relic. <laughs> Jacob but at least it's dead anyway. He's funny at times. Oh. Nick is just basic corny and has been gone from the story forever because he's a wolf. Okay, what else can we find in here? Megaphone? What the fuck is this? that? This soggy ass cardboard box. Trail cam footage. VHS? Oh, trail cam footage. It's like they're looking for something. Oh, from his little hidey hole thingy. The room. Yeah, uh, in Chris's surveillance room. This music, are you hearing this shit? He's storing all the footage, I think you might be right.
Ooh, okay. We got the evidence. Seven out of ten, that's pretty good. She trail camp for Hangar Woods dating back to twenty six years. I mean assuming if getting exonerated is like one of the plot points, I feel like the number would be five like six or seven. Five if they want to be really generous, more likely six or seven, so eight is kinda of crazy, unless it's like a super secret ending and not like really a core thing. If it's like they get arrested or they don't get arrested, probably six or seven. If it's like Oh, a little added scene, bonus scene, where you figure, that, like, maybe that's, like, that would be, like, 8 or 9, or maybe even 10 for some bonus. But I think we're ready to just get this show on the road. Let's go, boy. Let's go, Dylan, me and you. We're about to rock this shit. Let's go. We're ready for attack, baby. We're ready. Every dusk and dawn all through the summer. The fuck is this? Camp Moto? Camp, like Camp Moto? Camp Moto song? We're here to lead the way. That meets for life. Dylan don't know the <laughs> Dylan doesn't know the fucking lyrics. <laughs> That's funny as shit. Two months and you never learn the words. When you're trying to sing along to a song, don't know the lyrics that well, so you're just hitting the end like, uh, 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 30 racks. Mm, da 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 da. On my back. Mm, da 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 da. I'm 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 guilty of doing that shit. Ooh, handsome west, handsome west. Oh, shit's about to go down, huh? It won't be Silas, so it's either Caleb or Nick that's gonna be hunting us. Cause showtime, motherfucker. Cause Travis and them—they're trying to find Silas. Oh fuck. Let's face Jacob. Also, Is, he got out of the house. Is he just out here chilling? Okay, he is quite literally out, just out here chilling. Fuck this whole night. I just wish I could tell you I'm sorry. That was a lie, bro. Don't worry about it. You'll be fine. You'll be all right. Hands on my ass. Hands on my ass. I can't. As soon as I take it back to you, I put my hands on my lap or just on the side. Like just no, no, no. I can keep it on my ass. Together. Is that too much to ask for? <laughs> Shit. Stop. Crying, you big baby. <gasps> it's your fault we're in this mess, buddy. But we are gonna end the curse once and for all. And I'm keeping everyone alive, boy. I'm keeping everyone alive. Do we even want to kill the remaining werewolves? We we want to kill Silas, obviously. Do we want to kill Caleb and Nick if they run up on us? Like, I ideally we don't want to kill Nick, but... What is going on out there? Do you want to kill Caleb? No! No! We're safer in here and it's nearly morning. Oh shit. Oh shit. Hands on the mouse and Waz. Waz and mouse. Waz and mouse. What the? Oh my god, he's here. That's now nasty. What you really thought? What the fuck? Move, maybe? Hello? What are we doing? What are we doing? Come on. Come on, let's go. Let's fucking bounce. Let's bounce. Let's bounce. Let's bounce. Let's bounce. Let's do something. Make a move. Make a move, Kayla. Let's go. Give me a decision. Come on. Give me something. Give me crosshairs. Let's move. Let's move. Let's move. Let's move. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get a move on. 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 Plastic ass chair. Dylan. What the fuck is he? Dylan hiding? He doesn't have a gun, that's fine. I'm happy with him hiding there. That's alright, I don't mind, I don't mind, I don't mind. Maybe he's clobbering that is shit. That? Right? He is booming that door. It's Caitlin! Booming that shit. Well, we gotta let her in. Well, we can't. The office door's locked from the outside. But there must be something we can well, do. Yeah, but what? Window. We're gonna jump that shit. Silver what are we, Dora? <laughs> if you know, you know. Real easy. Silver shuttles. Okay. If we can time it right, we can give them to her. She passes. Where are these guys? If she passes. I I guess want to stay in the house then. Let's go beam. Do I want to shoot them with the silver though? Do I want to shoot the world? What if it's Nick? I don't want to kill Nick. 
Or there's gotta be for me to not kill. There's gotta be a way for me to not kill Nick, is what I should be saying. I don't know. Come on, give me an action. Give me something. Give me something. I can't be sitting here with my, with my fucking uh, dick out. Give me something. Come on. Action command, something. Alright, okay, Wes, let's go. Mash and With my dick out? Good lord. I'm going, I'm, I'm mashing, I'm mashing, I'm mashing, I'm mashing. I'm mashing, I'm mashing, I'm mashing, I am mashing, I am mashing. Damn. You are ass, brother. That's definitely Nick's dumb ass. Actually, I don't know. Caleb can be weak like Nick. <laughs> He's a bum. That's all that really matters. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Run and hide. Run. What the fuck? What do we look like hiding? No, let's go. Keep moving. Keep it pushing. Keep it moving. Keep it pushing. Keep it. Keep it, keep it, keep it blow. Caitlin. Okay, Dylan's way. here. Let's go. Good shit. We can get the silver bullets. We can get the silver bullets. Here, we can get the silver bullets. Is what I'm trying to say. Good lord, I'm stumbling on my mouth. Do we want to get the bullets though? If we get the bullets, we're locked into trying to kill this werewolf. I don't know if I want to kill the werewolf. Dylan, where are you go? I don't want Dylan to die, but I think I have to cover Dylan. I think I gotta go with Dylan and cover him. That's the kitchen, ain't it? He's. I gotta go help Dylan. I gotta help Dylan. Run. Just go help Dylan. Just go help Dylan. Just go help Dylan. Go help Dylan. Keep Dylan safe. Keep Dylan safe. Keep Dylan safe. Okay, path did. Okay. Are we moving on? Are we still... Okay. We're in the kitchen. Really? Boy, <laughs> put that fucking griddle down. Frying pan. Am I Dylan or am I Kayla right now? Oh, fuck. Okay. Hold breath, let's go. Let's go. That shit's clattering. I think this is a bad choice. We might be fucked, actually. Bro, look at this shit. It doesn't matter if I can hold my breath, I'm fucked regardless. What the fuck am I gonna do? He's not gonna just leave. Also, that weak ass werewolf, bro. Looking, peering over the edge, you can't see me. You are ass, brother. Okay. Oh shit, I missed my chance, didn't I? Oh fuck, did I grief? Okay. Okay. That loud ass clang, I know you heard that shit. I know you heard that shit. Come on. There's gotta be something we can use. Come on, we're in the kitchen. Run, freezer. Freezer, maybe? Let's go, freezer. Hide or use decoy? Use decoy. I don't know what that fucking is. Oh, the bunny! No fucking way, the bunny from chapter one. No fucking way. We're clutch. We're clutch. Got the bitch ass bunny. Let's go. <laughs> oh shit, last. Yeah, chapter one bunny, bitch. Get your ass in there. Let's go. Mash that shit. Mash that shit. <laughs> the bunny? No fucking way. We actually, the bunny saved our fucking ass. That also means he doesn't have to, whoever that is, whether that's Nick or Caleb, they don't have to die. Let's fucking go, Abigail. You didn't, okay, Abigail and Emma, you didn't give us the bullets, but that bunny saved our lives. So in the end, you did impact us. That's pretty cool, actually. I don't know if it's, in, I mean, probably intentional, but like, or I don't know if it's intentional for it to be the takeaway of like, they help you either way, but like, you know, it's cool. The real question is, is, that, is if that's Nick or Caleb, because that means the other one's just running around, and we still have to find Silas. Route 919, Laura, Travis, Ryan. Let's fucking go. Driving on the highway, shotgun on the left. Inquisitive, what exactly happened six years ago? Yeah, what happened six years ago? So what exactly Ooh. happened six years ago? There was a fire that wiped out dozens of people and now there's werewolves and a ghost that roams the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Which I've just put together is Silas, oh shit. Duh. It's a long story. Dumbass, what the fuck? No, it's not. There was a fire. Silas the wolf boy escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. Burn. Yeah, it's kind of fucked up, bro. He's been trying. What happened in the past doesn't matter right now. That includes the two months of us being held hostage, buddy? Actually, we need to know what we're up against, at least. 
What we're up against is a feral boy turned werewolf who for the last six years has avoided being found. No matter what we did. Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single one. Now the son of a bitch is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for good. Why do I kind of fuck with so Travis? How do you though? even know where he is? He kept us captive how for the, two how years. How are we gonna but... find him? Just driving. Oh the shit! Is that the other one or is that Silas? I can't tell. <laughs> Block your head, nice. Love that. You almost got conked out. Oh my god, Travis is slumped. Travis is slumped. Travis is slumped. Travis is slumped. Grab the wheel, bro. We're to crash. Wheel, 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 wheel. We're gonna crash. We're gonna crash. Get the wheel. Travis, Travis, get it together. Come on. Wake your ass up, Travis. Please lock in. Wazd, 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 wazd. Okay. I got it. All right, get your ass up. Good. Honestly, get the shotgun. Blow a hole in the roof, bro. Jesus. Oh my God, I almost fucked that up. I actually almost fucked that up. Holy shit. Oh, that's the white one. That's Silas. He's like pink and nasty. That's Silas' freak ass. Run his bitch ass over. Right? Jeez. That's like goddamn Gollum. Or like Harry Where'd Potter when he was like in he heaven. He just disappeared. Or is that Voldemort in heaven? Like the Horcrux thing? He's gotta be nearby. Path updated. Already. Path. Check the path. Oh, so we got some clues still. Like, these are all the ones we haven't figured out, but like they connect. Damn, we missed a lot of the pack of history. Love to hear more of this. These sixes. Plot generation plans. They really should have got that fixed. What does that? What does that do with anything? What does this mean? Did the house just break. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I think if I checked it when it happened, I would have been more aware. Down the rabbit hole. Abby chose to help Emma break into the cabin. Ugh. Abby was able to explore inside the cabin. Abby put the forgotten toy in her bag. Abby left her backpack in the lodge kitchen. Keaton and Abby and Nick were able to hide in the cabin without alerting the creature. The one was bitten by the creature when trying to hook up the feedback loop. Keaton was able to use the pull string toy to distract Caleb and trap him in the freezer. Okay, it's Caleb. Okay, we know it's Caleb. Okay. Well, uh, Caleb, you get to live, I guess. Because we're about to blow Silas's bitch-ass head off. And the curse will be gone. Uh, Lord and Oscar Travis... Ryan shot Chris. Ryan survived. Laura and Travis working together. Laura and Travis Ryan run Silas down after he attacked the car. Yeah, we knew that was Silas, but it's good to have the confirmation. Dylan and Caitlin went to the scrapyard. Caitlin and Dylan worked together. Abigail and Emma found silver shells. And Abigail found their way into the lodge. Caitlin has Dylan's company in the lodge. Caitlin ignored the office door and ran to the kitchen. Caitlin, Caitlin trapped Caleb in the kitchen with Dylan's help. Lovely was lost. Ryan decided to free Jacob from the basement. Ryan successfully opened Jacob's cage. Heard more Travis Constance's conversation. Cage was open when Laura broke the fuse box. They could find himself alone in the woods. So how do you get the, the last path? I only have 14 out of 15, right? There's just a whole path I missed. Damn. Let's look around. Are you crazy? He's weak, bro. He, we ran him over the car. He's primed for the killing. Killing. What's up with you, Ryan? Are you up? Are we there yet? Man. <laughs> You're okay. Wake your bitch ass up, Ryan. Better, but yeah. Wake your bitch ass up. We got a, we got a body, Silas. Okay. Got a body, bitch ass. Look at Travis. Over here. He is so gummy. Got some blood. We gotta follow that. I don't know where his hair. She cut it or is it ponytailed up? Leads through there. Why did you cut your damn hair, girl? What? I think it's in a bun, actually. What the hell happened back here? Whoa. This is... This is where we went off the road two months ago. You really cut your hair? You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. Go ahead. If that's what you want, I won't stop you. What? No, it's like a pony. <laughs> what? I don't know if he knows the full, ex the full like the, the whole the full extent of their relationship. Normal. Sure, like what the fuck? I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high risk. We could be killed. Okay, so that's what it is. That, that's what the blood is. It's werewolf. You ready blood. to end this? Let's fucking go, dude. 
Do you want to do this? Yeah, let's fucking do this. And fuck all that. I'm let's gonna, I'm gonna blow this. a fucking crater in Silas' head team. top. Right, let's go. Ugh, red lighting. Ugh, uh, uh, uh. Squad. It's so funny that Travis is here. Why is he low-key, my goat? Yeah, he's evil and he kept us hostage for two months instead of talking to us and being cooperative, but why is he low-key, my goat? He didn't want us to die. It's the important part. Okay, are we switching to Emma Abigail or someone, or are we just... Alright, no, we're continuing. Um, Let's fucking go. God damn, this place has got some uncool vibes. Podcast didn't do it justice. You don't know the half of it. This is where I saw her. Her? Oh, the hag. I thought she was... I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The woman. The old woman. The she hag, was saying something Corey. over and over again. The hag, hag, Corey. Oh my god, she was saying Silas. No, that's impossible. Who you're talking about? I saw her too, in the rum tunnels. It's Eliza Vores. Eliza. Silas's mother. Did we know her name was Eliza I already? Think. Who was she? Who was she? She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Called him Silas the Wolf Boy. They're shipping the cage? That's Died in the fire. pretty fucked up. Some say she never left. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. We've been looking for Silas ever since. Like, we're about to blow his fucking bitch ass head off. How did the fire start? It's gotta be the Hackett's, right? That's why Eliza's so pissed at them. It's gotta be. Come on now. Really? You're still hiding stuff now? Right? Spit it out, man. You blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hackett. One of the kindest, gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. Damn, that's tough. And all she wanted to do was help that little boy. Locked in a cage by that... I mean, you locked me in a cage, to be fair, man. What did she do? She just wanted to help him. Travis. What happened, man? Let us know. Come on, Travis. She can make the Caleb to start a fire. Kids. It was just a distraction. I think we knew that, though, already. Oh. It's May Bales. Give him enough time to get Silas out of his cage and give him his freedom. And, that, what and that whole shit no. caught fire. Because within minutes, everybody was dead. You ever see Hayburn? Liza? Whole crew? Damn, it was the Caleb kids. Get Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. It was the kids. That's why you've been hunting him. That's why you've been hunting him. Silas, I mean. You want to end the curse and save every full moon for six kids. fucking years. Caleb and Kaylee. Some hunter you are. Right? Like six years? That's kind of crazy, man. Y'all could have shot him once. This, this is all that's left. If it was me in that Jesus situation, Christ. South had done a year two. Tops. Man. What's this wreckage of the carnival? Any sign? Or whatever this shit's called. Negative. It's the circuit. Yeah. Damn, I never saw any of this. Is that a car? I didn't even know this was here. <laughs> is that a fucking car? Ryan, where are you going? Ryan, get your ass back here. Ryan. Ryan, don't get killed. Oh, hands on my ass, hands on my ass. Ryan, don't get fucking killed. I got my hands on my ass. Oh my fucking god. Ryan? Eliza, are you good, Shit. bro? I'm sorry, that was... Close. We must be close. Doing all this to protect your son that you kept in a cage kind of wish as I a literal circus rig? You're... Nah, man. Who do you think you are, wench? I'm about to blow a hole in that boy's chest. Finally, he'll be, he'll be free of his curse and he can live in heaven or something. I don't know. All I know is wherever he's going, uh, you are not. Because he might, he's probably going to heaven. He just He's a werewolf. He didn't try to do anything bad, what you know? He's, so he's, he's, just, he's just trying to have some fun. He wasn't trying to have some fun. He was just trying to live his life with that curse. Be. You kept him in a cage and now you're Careful. haunting all of us. Man. 
Shut the hell up. We're getting your ass. You're going to hell. You're going to hell, Eliza. Is that Silas? I'm ready. Hands on wires, hands on my mouse. I'm ready to blow a hole in that bitch. Sorry, Silas. Maybe you kept your mouth to yourself. Ah, it's not his fault, but like, damn. Fucking uh, Jesus Christ. He's the nastiest one. Jesus. He is so nasty. Eliza, shut up. You fraud. You helped us with the tarot cards, but... I'm trying to end this curse. I'm not, trying to, I'm not trying to let you live. Shoot, you stupid girl! Right? Laura, blow his head off. What the fuck? Yes, Ray's gun. What the fuck? Bro, we need to blow his head off. Blow him to bits. I got a sure silver-loaded shotgun. Yes, I'm sure about this. Eliza, get out my ear. Goodbye, Silas. Boom! Path chosen. Bye-bye, Silas. Bye-bye, Silas. The white whale. Better not shoot Travis. Ryan shot Chris Hackett. Ryan survived the ordeal. Laura Travis Ryan decided to work together. Laura Travis Ryan ran Silas down. Laura kills house in the line of infection, carrying every living person who was bitten at Hackett's quarry. Clues. We saw a headline scrap. The news about the North Kill because it doesn't look recent. Think about a fire. I was here Hackett's quarry. The fire of the Harem Scrim. Six years ago, there lots of many. It's rumored to have been arson. No wonder to me the front page. Kaylee and Caleb started the fire. It meant to distract and to free Silas the wolf boy whom they pitied. That's all that started. Chris Hackett was there. He took his present. None of the fires when Chris was bitten. So it all began for him. Is that it? Uh, kids that are home. Not just trying to pull us. Why is it trying to make something in this, to this ghost story? Ghost stories were true. The ghost of Eliza, the Hag Hackett's voice, has wandered these woods for six years looking for her lost baby boy. Well, good night to her lost baby boy because we body that son of a bitch. And I'm, I'm comfortable calling him a son of a bitch because Eliza, you a bitch. Please, let's just. Let's just go before we. We have to see him like that. I mean, you weren't that bad. You kind of just get bar got burned in a fire. And you wish your son wasn't dead. But, uh... Yeah, at the end of the day, you kept your son caged up as a freak show attraction. Like, come on, bro. You could do a bit better now. Respectfully. Not a parent, but I feel like that's kind of an easy thing to do. Sure, we... Did we do it? Did we finish? No deaths? Well, Constance got bodied. I bet you Kaylee got bodied. Have it all figured out. I don't know where Nick I is. You think you're fucking clever. I think I am fucking clever because I wouldn't live. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. And you did you warn me and you did help me. I started to like you. Dude, not your now. boy is suffering. Not after this. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. Oh my god, I've man. I've been with you all night. And I'm not about to stop now just because the nights come to an end. No. Ma'am, he was suffering. Whenever you hear a you noise were suffering. in the dark, a whisper from the shadows, the breath on the back of your neck, that's going to be me. I'll be there. Okay. Now I will never leave you. All right, I can handle that. I'll never leave you. I don't give a fuck. Like, what? Ma'am, I don't give a fuck. We body Silas. We cured everyone. Where the fuck is Nick? Nick has been AFK for like eight chapters. And there it is. I think we just beat the quarry. I think we just beat the quarry. And every counselor lived. Am I him or am I him? Like, what the fuck? Dude, I can't believe the bunny came in clutch at the end of the decoy. That is so fucking clutch. Holy shit. Hey, 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 hey. This is a banger. Hey, nice to Hey, Max Brindley alive. Having survived the night, Max is cured the world with curse when Ryan shot Chris Hacker with a silver shell. Love that, love that. Dude. Bobby Hackett alive. Uninjured, Bobby was able to fend up an attack from Chris's brother in world form. Okay, so I think if we stabbed Bobby, he would have actually died. Jedediah, alive. Thanks to Bobby shining off over Chris. Jed's about to hack, the attack at Hackett House. Is that Constance? Oh, Chris Hackett. Chris was killed when his favorite counselor, Ryan, shot him with silver. 
I wish there was a way to keep you alive and everyone else alive, but in that scenario, you're fucked, buddy. Laura shot Constance's face off in a struggle for the gun. Man, fuck Constance. Her face is clearly on, also. Kaylee, Chris Hawkins' daughter. Kaylee was shot and killed by Laura and mistook her for World Chris. Jacob, having successfully avoided infection, Jacob was free from the hack of the basement and survived the night. Nick! <laughs> Nick survived the night when Laura killed Silas, Nick's wherever Chris lived it. This guy was so useless. The whole story. That boy didn't do shit. Abigail... Blig? What kind of last name is Blig? Abigail made it to the safety of Chris Hackett's surveillance room. I must rather the night in the safety of Chris Hackett's surveillance room. Caitlin Ka. Can't survive by learning Caitlin to the freezer. He's the last rabbit toy left by Abby. That rabbit toy actually saved my life. I think we were fucked if we didn't have the rabbit toy in that kitchen. Dylan Lenivy. Dylan looked to see sunrise thanks to Caitlin trapped him. Caleb in the freezer. Sleepy me. Caleb Hackett, deceased. When Silas was, Silas was killed, Caleb lost a feral community and froze to death in the freezer. Oh. Okay, so uh, Caleb died. Travis survived the encounter with Silas and finally saw an end to the curse that had haunted his family for six years. Ryan was cured of the world of infection when he shot Chris and managed to survive the showdown with a white wolf. Well, Caleb died. I don't want really to give a fuck, though. Laura killed Silas with a silver shell, curing every infected person who survived the night. Salisvor is dead. Laura kills Salisvor the dog when his nest. Chris Hackett's quarry is broken. Can you guys have, like... I guess they weren't looking in the freezer, but can you guys have, like, let him out? Police pulled out. Did we get exon ex exonerated? Did we get arrested? Only time will tell, I guess. Um, What's going on? Are we going to get arrested? Or what's happening? What's happening? Psycho teens charged after summer camp massacre. <laughs> Psycho teens, one of my favorite punk bands. Okay, so I actually have a really. We got charged. Being sarcastic or not? I was being sarcastic. Okay. Really? Actually, it's very unfair. I thought we'd done the whole Hackett's Quarry thing. Not this Hackett's That's Quarry crazy. thing. That's crazy. What was this like three months ago? Old news, dude. Anton, introductions first. We are Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. I'm Grace. And I'm Anton. And together, we familiar. explore the possibility of supernatural girl involvement in real life, everyday occurrences. And that's exactly what they are. Real life, everyday occurrences. Damn, we got charged? That's a shadow like that. of spiritual, that's some bullshit. supernatural occurrences. Seven out of ten? No. Is it because how many people okay, died? Okay, so... I hope you've I mean, got hat and shirt and died, on because Kaylee, Kaylee, I'm died. about to Chris blow died. your mind. Did you just ask about hat insurance? Yes. It's responsible to insure those things which mean the most to you. A hat. Yes. Okay, I know where your priorities lie. Go on. Anyway, what is she from? There actually is a real reason that we're coming back to hat Her voice sounds quarry. so familiar. There have been some developments, and I've sourced some information. I remain skeptical, but I'm all ears. Under my hat. I what was hoping you'd from? say that. Oh, this is pissing God, me off why? a little why bit. Why are you smiling? Stop it, I hate it. Why? I had braces. I have to make use of them sometimes. You do have That why sounded Thank so you. familiar. That's something that a lot of podcast listeners might not know about me. Dude, I'm <laughs> tweaking so, out. What the fuck? It just so fuck? happens I've got someone on the inside. So today's episode is going to have a bit of a show and tell vibe to it. Who do you know on the inside? The inside of where? So I guess it's a matter what? of how many people you know die on the inside. And how much Don't we all get? have so someone on the if inside? Ten, you know, inner critic and says, "Stop doing a podcast. No one's listening." You should listen to that voice, Grace. That's okay, bullshit. Well, what I, don't I really meant is, we were let's call it an anonymous donation. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Know, we're not I'm head getting this shit. <laughs> flagged this as a bizarre situation someone actually reached out to us they sent us a package oh, cast. did you was there you even open it anyone who i don't trust anyone who listens to this show oh i, I couldn't name. wait to open it surprise anonymous it's donation. emily axford and brian you murphy me, since day uh, one of this honestly podcast, i didn't recognize brian murphy but I, that's what i was thinking of emily evidence. axford you will I've been recently getting into options, Dimension right? 20, that's why. Did you not say that? I did say that, yes. I mean, Sam, I know that's you know for Riz. that we would never <laughs> see any evidence. I did say that. Okay, well, we've been sent information, and we need to decide whether it's bizarre or bona fide. 
Okay, fine. Let's do this. For anyone listening at home, we are about to open a package from a mysterious person who listens Damn, to Damn, if I got more evidence, it's gonna be clear. If you are the one who sent us whatever it is, congrats, you got us. Sorry, the tape is just really, really, there's just so much to That's crazy. Sorry, can you tell me with this? I was really close to getting like a key. perfect ending almost. Slice at it, I got charged though. It is what it is. I don't care, everyone just lives. But just give me your fucking key. Man. This is oh, fake no. news. Just give me your fucking key. No, get your own key. I like you lock your door. Of course I lock my door. What are you what are you hiding? What am I hiding? Do you not lock your doors? No, I have nothing to hide. What are you guys you think yapping that about? Ghosts are real, but you don't lock your doors? No, ghosts couldn't open my doors. They could walk through my walls, Anton. Okay, you need to be more concerned with murderers. Take a look. Apparently they found another body. Whoa! You can't just show me a oh, picture that's like all the of evidence dead we body. You got to tell me before you're gonna do that. Okay, that's crazy. then let's take this over. Anton, can I show you a picture of a dead body? No! I can't work with that, Anton. Okay, fine. Yes, you. It, it's a dead body. Okay, wh it's what is this? What am I looking at? It's one of the hikers that went missing. Do you remember that? Yes, that's the true part of the story. Yeah. Ed Benson was his name. He Ed was Benson. drowned in the lake. Okay, drowned or was drowned? Now you're getting grammatical. I'm not getting grammatical. If you drown, you just went swimming and you drowned. If some, if he's been drowned, then someone drowned him. I love well, these guys. Then I think I implied precisely what I meant to imply. Now, of course, I can't verify this info. Of but course you can. What, do I have like a history of not verifying yes, my info? Yes, it's fake. Okay, but I feel very strongly that he was drowned okay well do the police know about this are the hackett family suspects okay okay i like that you are getting into this here's the thing the newspaper says this guy's still missing right he looks pretty fucking found in this picture right go to the fucking lake and yeah, search I mean, for it he's not missing he's right there but yeah why why would they say he's still missing because They're it is a up. conspiracy yep. a cover-up don't you see they're all in on it I, Travis is, who's was, all in on it? The Hackett the books. family? The Hackett family, the North Kill Gazette. I told you I've been suspicious of them from the start. Okay, uh, okay, so there's the one hiker, he's dead. What about the other one? Ann Radcliffe, still missing. Who knows how many bodies are still down there, though. Maybe we could have found Ann Radcliffe. I don't I mean, know, this is pretty one of the inclusive. I, three, I'm right? sorry that the guy drowned, but this kind of seems like a big to-do over nothing. Or is it a big undo of something, which is what a cover-up is? Okay, you can't just twist my words like that. Well, if that's not enough for you, what about okay. their back? I think I'm gonna call it here. They were found I'll maybe watch at out. Hackett's Quarry. Well, wait, seriously? I think I'm happy with that. Yeah, I mean, allegedly. That was the quarry. That was awesome. Allegedly, there we go. I really enjoyed that, actually. Okay. That was assumedly. awesome game. Right. Dude, allegedly uh, this, apparently that. Nothing's I missed ever some concrete, evidence. Fuck, These could but be anyone's best. I'm happy everyone lived. That's yeah, really the well, important part I to me. Choose so to thanks for watching. That these two if you like, particular hiking Holy Trinity, bags like, share, subscribe. I'll be back hikers. tomorrow or tonight. This is with irrefutable proof for me. But, uh, okay, well, that's Thanks for watching. Yeah, this game was awesome. I actually really enjoyed it. insanely low standards. Great foray into the Supermassive genre. circumstantial evidence at best. Super genre games. Do I have low standards? Games, or do I just that genre have of games. A more flexible Whatever. imagination? Thanks for watching. And that is how I'll all the greatest discoveries.